What is up? Welcome. What is good, everybody? Thank you for joining me. If you are a newbie to the stream, let me introduce myself. My name is Nessanox. I'm the Silver Succubus, hashtag Snackubus, fantasy variety streamer, aspiring voice artist, and fixer of chats. Yes, I have yeeted you all from the void permanently, I am fairly sure. Um, for my regular mortals, my members, my sweet souls, how y'all doing? Thank you for joining me. A dragon, next, I am very happy to see you, my love. I'm very happy to see your name in chat. Uh, we've got Dragon, Rashid, KP, hello, what is good? Panda, Re, hello. How we all feeling? Good news, the good news is we all here vibing tonight, that's what's good. Hello, Chaplain, welcome in, welcome, welcome. I hope the volume on everything is okay, I'm not too loud, not too quiet, let me know. Um, I am feeling very good today. Thank you, Dragon. Thank you for the huggies. I appreciate them. You know it, you know it. Um, I'm feeling, look, I say pretty good. That's a lie because um, I think we're instinctively tuned to respond that way, automatically saying that we're good, we're fine, we're this, we're that. Um, tonight I am feeling um, <clears throat> energetically drained, mentally drained, energetically drained. I'm not feeling the best tonight. We're not 100% up in the club, but it is fine. I think I would like to bring you to a more relaxing room if you will, uh, if you will have me. Um, let's come over here. There we go. Hello. So, I'm out here not feeling the best, but I still want to show up for you guys. I want to show up for myself, most importantly. And just because I am low energy does not mean today is low vibe. I hope you're all good. Next is better than yesterday. Yes, that is very good news. I'm happy to hear that. Um, I spent today thinking about a couple things I can introduce into my content, perhaps, to help you guys as much as me um so next please please take my big most humblest of gratitudes for um being you and existing because you've inspired me in the ways of um how i can adjust my uh, myself my content and my streams to um suit my own mental health better but as well as um providing a little bit more support to the mental health of others so thank you next um dragon thank you Oh, and thank you, thank you. I think I'm a little low energy as well because <clears throat> my housemate is currently recovering from some sort of um, bacterial infection thing. It, like, it fucked him up really hard and I thought it was food poisoning but then he got like pink eye or whatever and it's just, the whole thing's been weird so I don't know what the fuck he had but um, my housemate is currently recovering from that. Um, <clears throat> but we're out here, we've made some changes. I don't have as many... Um, if any distractions on my desk this evening, apart from the uh, the boba and the donuts you see in front of me. Um, I did actually go through and adjust um, my overlays. So now my chat, um, guys, you are visible. Uh, the void does not have you. This evening I do. It's a nice feeling. I like it, I like it. Um, so, let me turn down my headphones just a little bit. Um, so because I am currently um, just feeling like a very chill chill vibe tonight it's not going to be super high energy but we do have some progressive things that we are going to be getting through let me bring the background back in so y'all can see yourselves thank you so much for the hugs so far good time zone my lord i'm very thankful to have your company in my stream this eve how y'all doing oh that's okay rashid thank you but that's all right um so the plan tonight is we are indeed going to continue working our way through the Witcher. You know me, I am nothing if not tenacious. And I spent a little time on it last night. I've worked out a few more of the kinks that are in the game, which I'd like to explain tonight a bit later, once we jump in. Um, but I'm nothing if not tenacious, so we will be continuing the Witcher. But there is another game that i would perhaps like to introduce you to if you haven't already heard of it but i was um i kind of got intrigued by it today so we've got a fun little section while we chat we do have a fun little section i have planned before we jump officially into the game 
How did the Kafka fight go? We succeeded. Next, we actually made it on the... So I adjusted the team four times, I think. And on the final adjustment, we got her. We got there. I think the final winning team was Bailu, Black Swan, a March, and... I think it was maybe Dr. Ratio. It could have, but I don't think it was Look, I'm not sure who the fourth member was. I'll have to log back in and find out. I got a little farther in The Witcher yesterday. I played a little bit after stream and I've noticed a few adjustments that I need to make to my gameplay. As I've mentioned before, it's not a super friendly game when it comes to stream ability, but I will take a lot of that fault on myself because I don't think I gave myself enough time to actually adjust to the gameplay mechanics. I've noticed it is very old school and it's actually brought to my attention how easy games have become for us. So I have some intriguing topics to discuss this eve while we go through and game. Yeah, it was March, Black Swan, and Bailu, but who was the other one? Was it Luca or was it, um, was it Dr. Ratio? I'll be logging in at some point after stream, so I'll have a definitive answer I should put in the server, really. But, um, if you guys haven't checked out what is in the server lately, I've posted some thirst traps. I posted a video today as well. I shared a, uh, a content creator that I listen to. Um, that gives me good vibes, good energy, and good messages. I've listened to him for quite a few years now. Um, I posted that in the server, and hopefully it will, um, hopefully it will inspire one or more of you. In the forest's embrace, under moonlit gleam, Red Panda snuggles close in a tranquil dream. Mommy Nessa's love. A comforting balm in her arms, the panda finds sweet calm. Mm -mm -mm. Panda, I think I have to say that's possibly one of my favourite poems that you have given me the luxury of. I really do love that. Of course, I, I if I have any option to snuggle you close under the moonlight, heck yes, hello. Would, would take that opportunity 10 times out of 10. Let's go. <clears throat> and if you've got any wounds, any um, any scars on your heart, don't worry, Mummy Nessa's love balm is going to fix that right up. <laughs> oh, you guys are sweet to me. It's bit like, yo. Panda, I'm actually going to make it my mission to go through the, the server and my chats one day and try to write down as many of your poems and produce them in like a little panda poem book. <laughs> and refer to it whenever I feel lost. Uh, there's a series, let me uh, divert for a moment. There is a series produced from England called Black Books. It's a comedic uh, IRL series. <clears throat> and um, in one, uh, the first episode, I believe, one of the characters is having essentially a panic attack and he uh, needs his little book of calm. He's a, it's essential that he refers to his little book of calm and then he sort of, it calms him down afterwards. <laughs> it's quite funny if you get the chance to watch that episode of Black Books. I would highly recommend it's quite a funny series. But essentially, Panda, your poems could serve as my little book of calm one day. You've no idea. <laughs> <clears throat> It'll take me probably... Um, a year or so to be able to trawl back through everything. He is hoping you've been keeping track. <laughs> Mwah, thank you, Panda. You're a poet, Ari. Look, and we've all got skills, some of which pay the bills, other other ones are just perks. Um uh my my skills have the uh the benefit of being a little bit of both, I suppose. <clears throat> so I do actually have my timer on, so I know when I will be announcing a winner this evening. I'm actually using an app that grows a plant and times you at the same time. And if you don't use your phone and you just leave it sitting there, you go pretty little plant for your garden. It's quite um, good, so um, there'll be good mental health stuff coming in the server um, and in the community at some point soon. So. Before we jump into The Witcher, which I now have kind of sorted out the mechanics of, there's actually another game that I sort of discovered, and yes, I think I'm pretty fucking late on the news. 
but to be fair it did only release on um i think it was the 10th of january this year um well, thank you for the head pats viv welcome into stream give me a moment guys to hydrate Thank you for the Huggies Panda. We love them, you know it. Okay. I want to introduce you guys to a really cool game. Um, then I'm going to thank my members and my patrons. Then we'll jump into the Witcher. Sound good? Thank you for the Hydrate next. Let me get another little sippy sip of water for you. And while you are here, can I offer anyone a uh, snack or a beverage? Howdy, howdy, Viv. Hope the weekend treated you well, honey. Mm. Oh, and a stretch. You'll have taken care of me this evening. Thank you. All right, all stretched, all hydrated, feeling good. We've got snackies for anyone who might want one. Come thither with me over to this screen and let me introduce you to a fun game I have discovered. Guys, who here, let me know in chat, let me know if any of you have heard of the game um, AFK Journey. Have any of you heard of AFK Journey? Because I saw stuff for it on TikTok. I'll admit I saw shorts here and ads there. And I was kind of like, oh yeah, I just don't know. So I feel like I'm late on the news. But this game got introduced in like the 10th of January, I think it got released. So let me know in chat if any of you have heard of it or played it. Because I kind of want opinions. Yo, Silver Succubus Gamer sucks when? Oh, let's go that's such a good idea i would love something i would love to actually produce something that would be um vegan friendly um so something that doesn't have because i myself am lactose intolerant so i find my sources of protein and energy in other places um and because of my heart condition i'm sensitive to certain like ingredients and sugars so it would be really cool if I could produce something that was like a vegan and heart friendly gamer sup. So nothing intense, but something to maintain your energy and something to kind of like maybe something relaxing in there. So it's not really like an energetic one. It's more of like, a oh, what if we could have two? What if we had like an energy and a relaxation? That'd be fun. Three donuts for Rashid. I got you. One, two, three. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> there you go. <clears throat> haven't heard about it all right well i haven't heard much about it either i'm gonna be honest with y'all also i apologize if there's comments that go up in chat that don't come through i am not modding on my phone tonight i've just got to undo not disturb um i can mod from my computer i'm just not fucked with it on my phone rashid you've heard of the game okay so we've got a couple people seen ads hey um haven't heard some have look i only just heard let me be rude let me bring this over to my other screen so i can actually still see myself there we go <clears throat> okay so we've got your classic hero setup let's go through the who's he what's it's everything has it i remember doing this for genshin funnily enough if you all were here for some of my earlier streams i remember doing this and looking at the characters for Genshin and thinking some of them were like oh my god fine and dandy so I had no qualms with playing the game because I knew kind of what I was in for at least I had tasty characters to look at regardless of gameplay turns out Genshin is literally probably like my f I'd fuck I love that game <clears throat> yo that's a good idea next just make it 420 friendly as well hello Dragon, you've kind of heard of it. Good evening, Nishimaya-san. Konnichiwa. Thank you for joining me. Holy moly, that... It's a man. He's a man. 
but I've got men for you, sweetheart. Don't you even stress. Some of the ladies in this, some of the men in this. Yo, but what got me was because I seen a I seen like a one and a half minute trailer on YouTube, right? And it had voice acting in it and it actually enthralled me a little with the story. I liked the kind of animatic sort of vibe it had to it. Almost like straight out of a storybook sort of thing. Combat, probably not going to be my favourite, but I can adapt. But the voiceover, I was like, this is real cool. I liked the movement in the trailer. So we're going to go through a couple of the characters. We're going to watch the trailer. I'm going to switch on the OST as well, the website music, because the music was pretty fire. I'm going to lie. <clears throat> I knew it was you, General, of course. And the, oh, oh, you still choose me over the tea and the donuts. Well, thank you, thank you. Let me take these snacks away, get my magic off our screen, and allow me to introduce you to um, Valen. Roving swordsman, what separates victory and defeat is often determined by the swing of a blade. Aw, welcome in, Papa. I hope you're having a good day. And this is the light bearer faction. So there are multiple factions. So within this faction, next we have, ooh, Vala. Elegance, composure, and an air of mystery. <clears throat> Believe me. Hold on. Believe me. A well-constructed protective layer can preserve the underlying essence for extended duration. Notice they have, like, their little animatics as well. So he comes in with a sword swing. She transforms from, like, a rogue outfit back to a lady. Um, thank you for the head, Patty's Dragon. I appreciate you. Next we have Cassidy. Question, what is something that is out of reach, yet easily accessible? Something that is enduring and fleeting all at once? Answer, knowledge. Naturally, the Lyceum theorizes that this answer isn't entirely untenable either. And thank you for the hugs, General. You don't mind if I still call you General, do you? <laughs> what is this, Destiny? Better not be if it turns into destiny, I'll cry. Wait, what are you looking at? Oh, Rain, you're looking at me discovering a new game and possibly, possibly a new obsession. We shall see. AFK, yes, AFK Journey. Rain, have you heard of it? Have you seen any of the trailers? Because I only just seen a trailer today, but I had a voiceover and that's what kind of got me hooked in. Yeah, we've got Lucius, who's out here giving us... He's hes kind of giving us, like, long hair Japard vibes. Rain Senpai is here. She is my senpai. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Forged from light and courage, I raise this unbreakable shield in defense of glory and hope. So they have various roles, like, um, physical, magic. There's tank, mage, rogue. So physical... So it's pretty basic from what I can see. I think I'm going to be able to kind of grasp the concept a little easier than Honkai. Even though Rain has been explaining the, um, the enigmatics of that game to me of late. Med yes, the YouTube ads were crazy, okay? That's why I kept on scrolling because I got sick of them after a while. But then I seen a trailer... The fact that it has real... Eye yeah, it had real voice acting. I think that's what got me and... So I'm hoping the game itself continues the tradition of the trailer because it looked really cool, sounded really cool. So we'll watch it soon. But this is kind of, I scrolled past it a bit. And then what got me interested is the fact that they're, um, it, it, the styling of it, the visual style, I really like. I even have art in this style of my character. Something about a storybook brought to life. We're digging it. But not only that. Your girl has seen that there is a form online for people to um, become like a content creator for this game sort of thing. So the business side of me got intrigued, the imaginative side of me got intrigued. And so we're kind of exploring tonight to see if it's going to be a definitive, do I want to play it? Do you guys want to watch me stream it? And uh, whether or not it's going to be the new kind of thing that I want to go through because... Honkai 
takes a lot of good elements from Genshin Impact, but then has a lot of negative elements in the fact that it's um, turn-based combat. This kind of looks more like League of legends -y sort of combat, which I liked doing the TFT, which is the team fight tactics. I do like organizing battles in that sort of aspect. It's the turn-based combat that sort of gets me because it's all numbers and higgledy-piggledy weaknesses, what, what have you. Um, so the next faction is Wilder. Who in the house likes druids? Hello. We love things with horns and ears and they're very, very cute. So this fella is called Iron, uh, born of the jungle winds from my homeland. No matter where I stand, my spirit and blade remain ever keen. So he looks cool. It's like a Legolas with horns kind of digging that this bunny girl she's been all over the ads um so obviously they've got a couple characters where they're like catering them to the community i guess viv oh yep yeah, true oh thank you yeah i don't know whether i'm like 100 percent interested i'm intrigued at this point we're intrigued so with your help my little community, my sweet souls. We shall figure out whether this shall take a place next to Genshin and Honkai. Or whether or not it might just be me looking at pretty characters and being like, oh, thirsty. Um, good thing is, I think you actually get access to all the characters for free when you start playing it. And I think it's more mobile friendly. I think that's kind of what interested me too. The fact that they've been promoting ads for it. Like, I wouldn't play Genshin on my phone. It's a way better PC experience. But the fact that I can play this on PC, but it's tailored for, like, phone play as well, I kind of like that aspect. But that's what that... But yes, this is her. This is Laika, the Keeper of Glades. Uh, as dusk falls, stars illuminate the night sky, offering direction to lost travelers. She is a physical marksman. Of the wilder tribe so little bunny goyle this is where you have seen her from next off the bat though this is giving me studio ghibli vibes granny danny oh my god i am actually here for her all right all right let me the world is your oyster come back for a bowl of warm soup when you need comfort oh granny daddy yo i'm not just out here thirsty for the mommies and the daddies sometimes the grannies come through as pog champs too she's a physical tank which i love for her i just get lost to get guided by her yo you just want to get lost in the forest so bunny girl comes and finds you <laughs> that's what i mean rain like genshin you can but you shouldn't just because just you can do something doesn't mean you shouldn't. And I already deleted Time Princess off my phone because the size of that game was making my phone feel clunky. It felt clunky. Oish. So, um, yeah, we got Granny Danny who's coming through with a shield and a little spear. Oh, Forest Guardian. My heart. My soul for Granny Danny. <laughs> then we've got Arden who's an oak sage. Every venture adds to your wisdom. We often label the learning journey as growth. <clears throat> Hello, did someone put um, Uncle Iroh into a little satyr character? Look at his horns. His horns are putting mine to shame. But do you see how his curve back and up and around? That's technically how my horns are meant to be. <laughs> They're not actually like bull horns. They kind of go up. They go back and then they curve around and in. It's just... <laughs> it's hard to do. It's hard. it's hard to fucking rig. It's hard to draw, okay? So third, we have the Molar faction. And oh my god, if this didn't... This, this faction was the second... Uh, there's one more character after this where I was like, sold, immediately sold. But this faction, I was like, God, oh, you're hooking me in. You know what I like. And this made me wonder, am I, a I don't think I'm a fairy. But God damn, I'm questioning. <laughs> yeah, she is the grandma you threaten your bullies with. You don't want my grandma to come, she'll fuck you up. And she does. Throws a warm bowl of soup in your face. Watch out. <clears throat> The Molar's spirit courses through every heart among our people. 
I have vowed to step onto the battlefield, guarding against even a hint of dishonor. This is Brutus, the blood claw. Ooh, blood for the blood god. Give me a little bit of that red stuff for the red god. Look. <laughs> and he'll do it. He'll take it. Look at that sword. Wee. Okay, now, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Here's the thing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo. <clears throat> Nessa is an Omega. Don't you dare fucking say it, dude. Don't ever say it again. <gasps> Shakira. Oh, good luck. Jesus, take the wheel. Your girl doesn't know how to feel. We got a physical rogue, a lost wolf king. This, this is all of my dreams come true. Can I, <clears throat> can I just give me, give me a second for the animatic? Wait for this. <gasps> it's like someone took. So. <laughs> Canonically, I feel like if Razor became a, a, a full grown wolf boy, oh, good lord, hide. <laughs> this, made, this made me crazy. I saw this before stream. I was like, holy, am I a fairy? <laughs> That is stupid. <laughs> Only took a year and a half to admit I'm a fairy. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Jesus, too many Christmas. So, Geralt mixed with death from Puss in Boots. Oh. <laughs> mm. He makes my puss shake in my boots. Oh, let me tell you that. <clears throat> As he says, as long as I'm present, the Scorch Tooth clan lives on. I will not falter, even if it entails sacrificing all that I own. Ooh, he is, he's giving me everything I need. You don't understand what this feeds in me, okay? And I've got a girl for you all next that's going to feed something in you. Shut the, shut the fuck up, Ryan. Ha 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 ha! Yo, Risley, the Risley had me at hello, but then I was like, hello, when I actually played his character trial, I'm like, eh, I don't trust a big muscly man that wields a book. <laughs> Shakira, look, Shakira, Shakira, I don't think them hips be lying. Thank you for the hugs, panda. <laughs> Blood for the wolf, everything for the wolf daddies. I'm sure some of y'all out here liking Brutus. We like a big fucking... What is he? The cowardly lion that finally got his shit together? Oh, hungry. And I'm hungry like the wolf. Something is something. What's up, Acti? Welcome to the stream. He came in at the simpiest time. Look, here's one for you, though. Now, Acti, you're here. Can I interest you in Satrana, the Ember Enchantress? Boys, even ladies, ladies, I'm from a lot of you. I'm like, mm hmm, them curves. <laughs> the way she be looking like a character out of Tekken with that top. <gasps> Hello? <clears throat> we have, let me give you her animation again. Ooh, a little tail flick, little ear action for the. for the. <laughs> For the fairies in the house, I feel you. <laughs> in the chilly desert night, flames, fair, and dance are all essential. Alongside passion and laughter, our wooga is right. Can I get a hoi for the hot satrana? <laughs> Yo, oh, Rain, I'm so sorry. Look, y'all don't, y'all really don't get a choice though. Is she into sports? Um, I think she in herself is quite an athletic activity. Did, does it count? 
Yo, Panda, what's good? What's up in the hood? Hiya, Panda. What do you want me to wear tonight? Let me know. Look, Satrana's fire. She gives us a little something. But oof, oof. If this isn't giving, like... Is this like Candace in an alternate universe? Like Cat Candace? Oh, red one, let's go. Wee. Viv's just here spectating, eating eating the popcorn. <laughs> well, she is an athletic activity. I can be an athletic activity. You don't know me. You don't know me. <laughs> All right. Mm, kitsune, yeah, 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 good idea. These people can't be out here with their ears and their tails without me. And, and Tandra, that was a bit one. And Antandra, oh, like a double entendre, you know what I mean? <laughs> Candace, uh, run. Actual, de actual desert dwelling. We could, could we have seen it ever in our lifetime? Apparently, it's here. <laughs> Agdi, there's a difference, okay? This girl, this girl right here is an athletic activity. I am simply exhausting. <laughs> there is a difference. It's a fucking look. She's an activity. It's an act. It's a fucking race to keep up with me, sir. So. <laughs> Entendre is a shield for self-defense, a spear for the defense of others. I believe therein lies the meaning of battle. Guys, how pogs would it be if, like, this game just called me up and they were like, Yo, you look pretty good with ears. We like your voice. You're a bit weird. Want to be in our game? <laughs> I'd say yes in a heartbeat. As long as I get this guy's number. Let's go! <laughs> More a mechanical activity because you try... <laughs> and your gears all clogged up. All right, for the dark mages, for the dark sorcerers in the house... For those who like a little bit of the dark side, <clears throat> we have the Graveborn faction. I think dark mages, necromancers, underworld sort of vibes. Very cool. No, <laughs> let's go next. We're, we're gonna. We are going to manifest it. Trust. This dude is a Viperian. The naive may misconstrue that giving guarantees returns. Yet in reality, one gains only at the cost of pain. <laughs> and his little bone serpent thing, we're out here sliving, okay? Sliving the Graveborn faction dragon. I knew you'd like it. How did I know that would be your favorite dragon? Acti, that there's a reason you can keep up with me, little bro, because you're fit as fuck, okay? There's few that can. <laughs> this lady. Oh, this lady. You want to know what was the final selling point for me on this game? This gorgeous. Let me give you the animations again. This. Oh, oh. Step on me with those foresty feet. I see your thorns, baby. Oh, won't you poke one through me? Let's fucking go. Thank you for the hugs, dragon. <laughs> this lady, she makes me feel things that I want to feel consistently 24 7. It's fucking over rain. We're done here. Destruction is often a cruel and dirty business. Thankfully, having servants makes it so one never has to do these things personally. Oh my god. Jesus, take the wheel. Because my hands are busy right now, if y'all know what I mean. It's over, son. Let's go. <laughs> The jiggle physics though, let me let me see that one more time. Yo, I appreciate your snake, sir, but put it back in your robe. 
Oh, the little jiggle on the chest. Yes, yes, yes. Can I say, chat, the size comparison, my boobies are actually about the size of hers, okay? Like my character, my OC. I wish IRL. <laughs> um, my OC, me, who you see in front of you, my boobies are actually a little large for my preference. Her, she's got dynamic chest. Dynamic everything. I'm I'm sold. <clears throat> so, Requiem of Thorns. Hello? Yo, you are going to have to come to Australia and restrain me. Honestly, you get on a plane, tie me the fuck down, because... Oh, row, 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 row. Yo, I have so... I've got over 80 wishes saved in Genshin now. Fuck the Deluke banner. I spent 40 wishes and Deluke still didn't come home. Anyways. I got so many wishes in Genshin. I, I'm saving them up in Honkai. So yes. Alakino. Got to be a guaranteed. Boot Hill. Got to be a guaranteed. But I've got a little more space in my heart. I've got a little more room in my life. Look, there's there's no special little, little, little look. Ain't nobody ever gonna step up the Miko standards because god damn that lady's got a reserved place in my cranium. But I got room for one more. Cecilia, what's up, Cecilia? Hi, Cecilia. What's going on, girl? And I got room for look, there's there's room, there's room, there's room. I'll make room, okay? <laughs> <clears throat> Next, don't be traveling on those delicate feet. She's not got footwear, and how will I worship them when you're in front of me dressed as her? Oh, God. <laughs> Rain, it's over. It's over. <laughs> Everything is just contributing to the overness. Thorin, fallen king, Thorin, my subject. Whether in life or in death, loyal or traitorous, bow in reverence, your king hath returned. Very cool, we like a undead king. And finally, Sylvina. Look, can I can I get a little affection for Sylvina? Because I feel like this is going to be the taste for some of y'all. I feel like some of y'all are really going to like Sylvina, okay? <clears throat> She's sort of giving like short hair me vibes. <laughs> One of those floats carry us up. <laughs> easy, easy peasy. Just get a cronk to carry you all the way like he does on that little map. Just get a cronk to like Yzma transport you all the way to Australia. Save those beautiful feet. <laughs> Sylvina. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, this is ethereal fantasy RPG known as AFK Journey. I'm just quickly go uh, well I say quickly going through the characters, but I kind of like all of them. I like the visuals. Sylvina is the taken breath. Perpetrators, why? Victims, how? Insignificant minutia, unrelated to the mission. I execute. Plain and simple. Oh yeah, it's all coming together. See you later, Acti. Thank you so much for tuning in, little bro. I will see you next time. Enjoy the rest of your day, so Rest of your day, so. All right, so we've got Celestial Faction. This is a bit of a smaller faction. The rest have had four characters guaranteed Zs, okay? So these last two, the Celestial and the last one, I think only have a smaller amount of characters. This is Scarlita, Herald of Passion. Really cool design, really, really cool design. I love the symmetricality of it. I'm a fiend for symmetricality, yo. Compassion and punishment coexist. In many instances, the cruelest discipline is the most selfless forgiveness. You don't like the celestial for how? Come on, give him a chance, dragon. We've got Skull Eater, physical warrior, and this. Okay. Okay. The earrings are doing something for me, okay? The earrings, we like it. We're here for it. And in all honesty, I think this game has done a very good job with appealing to all different tastes, as it were. 
<clears throat> Papa's out here giving the giving the back alley hints if you want to see some weird bunny girl action. Hey kids, want to see <laughs> opens up your trench coat. Hey kids, want to see some weird bunny action? Right next, I thought you'd like him. Dionel, the Venus Blade. Ooh, he made me a little. I was like, okay, I see, sir. I see you. What's up with him? Ooh, I like it. In the ever changing vicissitudes of life, time slips away in the blink of an eye. Let's relish this very moment to the fullest, my dear friend. He's kind of giving like a blonde, muscly Cusco. So I love. Look at the hair though. Hair envy. Yo, his hair is longer than mine. Next, you're on your knees. Let me give you the animation again, my love. Hold on. Oof. You want him entering your bedroom like that? Yep. <laughs> if anyone asks why you're consistently on your knees, you can just say, I'm praising the sun. I'm praising the sun. Yo. So celestial faction and then hypogean faction, okay? Rogue magic burial is the sinister jester. Bask in joy, my dear. Misunderstand not. A smile forever changes nothing. Yet it paints a more charming facade in times of devastation. Cheer up and put on your happy face. Oh my god, you're going crazy for him. <laughs> you are going as crazy for Dionel as I went for Shakia, okay? Girl, I think we're going to be in this game together, alright? I think we're going to be in this for realsies, though. You're going to be in it with me? You're going to take the AFK journey with me? Hello? <laughs> and then we've got Rainier. Who was asking for a character from Diablo? Who was asking for a Diablo-ish character? We've got this four-armed, uh, twelve-horned gentleman. Yo! Like the horns on his pauldrons, that's kind of exactly how my horns are meant to go. It's kind of cool. Rainier, balanced of evil. In the golden ratio and equilibrium. The world grows more beautiful, and I stand above it in perfection. He's serving vibes of that villain guy who was in Brutal Legend. What was his name? The one that was voiced by um, Tim Curry. <clears throat> no. Rashid's like, next year, okay? Yeah. Rashid, shh. She's fine. I've got a serviette right here for you, girl. <laughs> Sheesh. Hypogean. Okay, so Dragon, your favourites are the Hypogean and the Graveborn. Guys, let me know what your favourite factions are before we head off to the next section. Because we're going to be ending this by watching the trailers, essentially. Um, after which we'll jump into Witcher. After Witcher, Witcher, Witcher. I'm 20 and now I'm not okay. I need an adult. I can be the adultier adult for you next. Don't even stress. Don't even worry. I got you. So, Dragon likes Graveborn and Hypogean. Personally, my favourites would probably be the Wilder and the Mauler. I'm going to lock those two in as my favourites. The Wilder and the Mauler. Because one is serving my thirst, but the other is serving my storybook dreams so it's a nice combination rashid wants to see me play the game oh good rashid i'm i'm actually really interested in playing it to be honest so i think it's gonna be a go be you love me more oh dragon so i think those two are my faves guys let me know if you've next i already know your favorite characters hello dianelle so um, the essential concept of the game is that they are various factions trying to reclaim their homelands. So we have the deep uh, Deer Spirit Altar. I apologize. The Deer Spirit Altar, which I'm going to presume goes to the um, 
wilder tribe. Um, then we have the Lucent Tree. Um, probably like the darker faction would be that one. The um, the one that Dragon likes. Whatever have whatever faction has the most girls with the most kissable rips will take it. <laughs> Holy Stone is definitely going to be for the uh, human faction up top, which I forget their names. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Light Bearer. Okay. So this is going to be for Wilder. This is going to be for White Bearer. This is probably going to be for Graveborn. This looks like Mauler territory, Ryham. Right, um, so, but there's only four maps, but there's more than four factions. Now, how is that going to work with the Celestial and the Hypogean, I wonder? So, that's a cool little concept I'm looking forward to finding out. <clears throat> so, game features, as Rashid mentioned. Anywhere you go, Magic Follows, it is an ethereal fantasy RPG. If ever there were three words that would get me interested in a game, that's pretty much it. Dino is your favorite. Rashid likes the bunny girl. Yay. Always go for necromancers, says Panda. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's, I like that it's kind of catering to all tastes. Which is a little tiny bit. <laughs> Thank you for the huggies. Just, just a tad. <laughs> I reckon it's going to be a go. So, lead six factions to their destiny. Um, master battlefield strategies. So, it does have that... Um, bird's eye view kind of game concept to it the tft it's sort of you can acquire resources effortlessly and i'm pretty sure you also manage to get all the characters for free when you start and then you can just collect more and like extras um customize your formations two seconds customize your formations but as you can see yeah like they've got different skins the characters have like different kind of like these are two characters that i didn't see in the um that I didn't see in the faction lineup. So there's more to the game than what they're showing. And yeah, get all hero free with free login rewards and events. So because they're looking for English content creators to stream, um, I think this might be a go for us, guys. Um, I think this might be a new game that I add to my collection. Um, so without further ado, we're probably going to watch the trailer. Oh, so sorry for the ads, guys. So sorry for the ads. Block annoying ads. <laughs> oh, no. All right, here we go. My voice is starting to fail. You can... You, you, yeah, it is. I've got soothers, but... Yo, actually, let me... Two seconds, chat. Thank you. Thank you, Panda, for calling me out. Yeah. Cheers, Panda. Appreciate you. <laughs> yes, my voice is starting to fail because I've done a lot of recording um, and uploading and streaming lately. So it's just one of them things. All right, so let's watch the um, let's watch the trailer, shall we? And then I'll take a BRB and then we'll jump into Witcher. Sounds good. <laughs> Hi, Jay. Okay, okay, fine. Have it. The Oop, hold up. I'm just quickly going to fix my uh, window capture because it does not seem to be. There we go. Beautiful. I can just. There, there we go. Now you can actually see it all. Fantastic. Alright, we're going to watch a trailer or two. And if the volume's too loud, I shall fix it. Clashes of the gods. So Fuck, and we need subtitles. Sorry, I'm trying to. Cater to everyone here. Okay, there we go. I think we're there. Tales have it that clashes of the gods set Asperia ablaze. In a world torn by the echoes of devastation, hope descended in silence. The chosen voyager of the prophecy would arrive, seeking the swords long lost to time, leading the heroes into this new journey. Maybe his powers. Save 
Yo. Wait, so did it only just come out? Am I actually not late on this? Am I actually not late on rain? I'm so sorry, but as a mod, can you play because I've got my screen up? Mod. 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 <laughs> I need you, mod. <laughs> rain, I thought I double checked it earlier, but clearly I got my numbers wrong. Can you please confirm the release, like the actual release date of this game? Because I thought I was late to the news, but I might only be a week late. <laughs> Zero out of ten because DNL wasn't in the trailer. <laughs> I didn't see any wolf men. I would like another trailer, please. <laughs> oh no, I'm fine, Rashid. I put myself on mute so I could hydrate. Thank you, Nex and Dragon for hydrates. But I was also opening my packet of soothers and I didn't want it to be all loud on the microphone, so I muted myself during the trailer. These are clever little things that us streamers do to make things flawless. Washa washa. <laughs> Dragon's liking the game. We like it, we like it. I want to see if I can find the other trailer that I've seen. Hmm. 13 days ago. Paxis. Wait. No need to confess. So I'm not late. This is like a week. This only came out like a week ago, no? AFK Journey is crafted for both fans of the AFK franchise and for those who are new to the series, which is me. Offering an RPG experience that is both approachable for beginners and satisfying for avid gamers. It was this Nessa Knox bitch on my screen. Get out of here. <laughs> Game looks genuinely good. I think so too. So, um, it's only really just beginning. If you guys are interested to watch me play it, which I think you are, I will be, um, probably doing updates in the server and then I might have to do, uh, like a separate channel. Um, also... I'll post it in the Discord server, but I got a random invite from Discord <clears throat> to like a Genshin community, like a beta for a Genshin community sort of thing. So I'm like, what's going on? So I don't know. 27th of March, the last week. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Rain. Yo, so we're not late on the news. I thought it got released in like January. No, we are not late on the news, people. We are fresh onto it. If you're going to be playing the game, let me know. I'll be putting, um, all the links and everything you need up in the Discord server, and I will also be applying to the makers of the game to see if I can become a content creator for them, because uh, it looks really fucking cool, and considering the soundtrack and the visuals, hell yeah. I'm definitely going to be a part of it. So, let me fix my fucking triggers. Why won't the fucking blush get off my face? There we go. Oh my goodness. Mm, so... There you go. There you fucking go. 
That's exciting though. It is exciting. I'm excited to play it. I'll download it. I'll let y'all know kind of like the size of like the files and stuff and maybe I should just be the beta tester and then I'll hit y'all up in a week and be like, it's good. It's not good. It's fun to play. It's not fun to play. Blah, 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 blah. Anyway. So. Quickly before I go to BRB. While I'm on BRB in fact. I would like to take a quick second to thank my patrons and my members for their constant support of me. Um, patrons, I've got two tiers, so these are all just mixed in together. And then members, I've got three tiers. Uh, so members, let me give you your thank you first. Thank you to Snake Redstar. I can never say his name right, but I just call him Snake. <laughs> Alright, thank you to Snake. Panda, Walker, Nexus, Lotus, Kalumi, Viv, Kyle, Nex, Alan, Boost, and Trevor, who is a new member. Thank you so much for being here, for supporting me. I hope you make good use of the emotes that are debuting April 12th. You'll mean the most. Thank you for being part of my little schnackubus squad. To my patrons, there's a lot of you on a name. But I'm trying to get through as best I can with my voice breaking. Give me a second. So, to my patrons, thank you to Baron Bonehead, Bob Smith, Dustin Sailor, Eric Viv, Hera Doctor, J Bot, Quadro K, Steve Baker, Alan J, Alien Overload, Andrew Rice, Emperor Da Ho, Evendo De Mello, Glorix, John, Josh Moran, Kevin Greb, Kiri Comrades, and Spacewalker. For those of y'all who are patrons as well as members, y'all are extra poggers. I gotta find out a way to actually properly give y'all a reward. More than the reward of everything that I'm already trying to force into your hands. Take the artworks. Take the audios. Take the photo sets. <laughs> but a huge big thank you to you guys just for giving me that extra little bit of support to help me continue to create fantastic content for you guys. Upgrade my gear, add more things to stream, etc, etc. You all mean the most to me, you know that. And a big kiss. Come here. Mwah. I should have said, unless you're a patron or a member, block your ears. <laughs> oh, word. Well, apologies, next, but I don't know which name in there is your dead name. So I'm sure next month, when the time rolls around, I will be calling y'all out on both. So thank you for being both a patron and a member, sweetheart. Mwah. I love that for you. Oh, honey. It's cool. It's fine. It's all... Look, take it out with Patreon, man. That's an issue. We need to speak to a manager. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to take y'all to a BRB. I'm going to quickly get up, stretch, and hydrate. I would recommend y'all do the same. Please and thank you. When I come back, we're jumping straight into The Witcher, and we're going to be playing it for the rest of stream. So, I bid you adieu for now. I'll be back in five minutes. Um... Okay, cool. Back in five minutes.
and we are back we are back we are back thank you for hanging around everyone i appreciate y'all all right i'm gonna get my witcher set up give me a minute do you want to hang out on the snack screen while I do that? Let's 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 go hang out in the lab for a little while while we um while I sort out my um white wolf wherever he be. <clears throat> white wolf, well, how about white wolf? I'm getting it set up, y'all. Um, I think I might be getting sick. To be honest, I'm gonna I'm be real with y'all. I think I'm getting a little sick, and mentally, physically, I've felt myself getting to kind of like the short end of the candle. I think I've been burning the candle at both ends, and it's finally a little stub. So, um, whether or not I uh, take next week off, uh, right the like right before the subathon, I might need to take a break. Before the other one starts, I'm a shitting girl. My favourite part of the witch show is when Geralt said it's witching time in a witch toilet. <laughs> no, don't say that because that's what season four of The Witcher will be on Netflix. I've already heard you. I've already heard you. <laughs> Y'all gotta go, alright? Thank you so much for hanging out with me, Pandora. I appreciate you. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the huggies, giving them right back. See you next time, bro. Have a good day. All right, we've got this loaded up now. Thank you so much, guys, for giving me the time to uh, show you the new game that I was interested in as well. I appreciate you. Um, it is probably something that I'm going to um, get going in the next um, in the next little while. <clears throat> it's definitely something I want to figure out because it looks cool as fuck. So, anyways, let's get into the Witcher Shadow, shall we? I'm planting my little plant. I'm switching off me lo-fi. Let's bring in the Witcher and hope that he's not an exponential volume. <laughs> Geralt. That's fine. <clears throat> they took Henry Cavill out so he could conquer planets. <laughs> Honestly, like, that utmost amount of respect for that man for just being like, nah, you know what? Fuck you. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna check in I on the time. With the fire out. Seems I have to light it first. Oh fuck, and that's fine. All right, well we just finished meditating. I'm gonna gauge. I'm gonna hope that this is the right time. It's gotta be before midnight for me to access this warehouse and progress the story. No sign of Jabed or the professor. Look, I managed to cave easily. Advance the story. Ha 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 ha. Look at me go. I managed to finish it out last night. So we're still after the alchemist and the salamandra people and Who's this? This wasn't our deal, cop. Relax. Oh dragon, you're very witcher. sweet. Thank Surely you. you know witchers are golems. That's very no adorable of you to say. Thank you. Easy, no complaints. Right, Geralt? We could say, cut the crap, caught you red-handed, you're dealing with Salamandra, but that would blow the whole thing out of the water. So let me preface and set this up for anyone who um, wasn't here at the end of last stream, or hasn't been here for the last couple of Witcher streams. We're progressing through the story to find out, one, what happened to the Witcher that came to town, which I since have. He's died, unfortunately, and his sword has just been making its rounds. Um... The second thing was the alchemist and the cult, essentially, that uh, worked against the witches in the very beginning of the game to steal their um, steal their potion recipes, such and such. That's basically the Salamandra cult, and the Javed is like the alchemist guy. Um, and then we've got another alchemist that we're dealing with that's double-crossing us and setting people up. So, I've progressed the story a little. We're still going to make our way through. But that's just setting f up for what this is, okay? <clears throat> I'd just be the opposite of myself. I'll be my shadow self. Right. See? <laughs> Nothing to be afraid of. 
<laughs> you didn't exactly come alone. Darkness already exists, deal. but I like I that idea. I don't trust him. <laughs> he was a fucking murderer, cut up over a dozen of our people. Let's not play who killed who. That's the past. We're interested in the future. Yeah, I think I can actually fuck around Your with that future, now. Give me a second. Which will be unpleasant if Javed learns you've cheated him. And believe me, he'll learn. Oops, so sorry, so sorry. You're bluffing. God, I can't fuck around with it Good during job. the cutscene. Where are the Witcher's secrets? Spit it out before I feed you to the rats. Vincent, stop him! <laughs> I know nothing. I was assistant to Salamander's account. I know accountant. nothing. Javed, stop trusting me. I don't know where he is or what he intends. You do. The professor. Tell me, you're a bastard. I, I don't know. He went off somewhere. Bullshit. Bullshit. You, need you promised me protection in exchange for my testimony. On my mother's grave, I know nothing. Stop him! You're a cop. Hello, this by the murder. way, Polly. You, you're hello, hello. Stand by and watch. No. Hope you're having I'm a good Raymond. day. Welcome Besides, to the stream. How you doing? I know you had a part in murdering Raymond's family. Witcher, make it quick. Ooh, 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 ooh. Straight into the El Axion. All right, that's fine. I think I got a potion for this. Y'all want to wait because I've been alchemizing like fuck. All right, give me a second. I need 20 owl. Nah, what's the one that slows down time? Oh, no. All right, vitality is my health, endurance is my yellow bar, so I need something that gives vitality. Because I got no other potion. <laughs> I don't have the other potion I need, man. There's this one potion and it like slows down time. Hmm. I don't think we have anything to help us. So we're just going to escape hey, and hope for a win. Hey. Alright. Ready? 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 Oh my god. No, we need the silver sword. Thank you. And we need it. Group. Alright, that's two down. He's kind of over there. Why aren't you dead? Right, that should be him down now. Very good. And you need heavy. Alright, people do ya. Noish. A noish, noish, noish. Didn't end up needing any potions. Some skills that pay the bills. Let's go. What have you got? Take your money. Win. So I'm collecting salamandra pins. Basically, I think I've got to cash them in somewhere for something. Oh no. Oh no, I didn't want that. No, no, no. Drop, 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 drop. Where's my axe? Eh, eh. What do you mean inventory is full? Can't carry any more items. I just fucking dropped it out of my inventory. See, it's right there. Axe. Alright. Axe, axe, heavy axe. Where's the why are they different to me? It's a heavy club. Alright, maybe the heavy club's what I want. Oh yeah, and I've still got my flail. Okay, we'll take the heavy club. We'll keep the heavy club. Fucking I paid good money for that axe. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> okay. Right now, I need to speak to whomst? Whomst do I need to speak to? Vincent something. Good to hear, Polly. Enjoy your stay. Get comfy. And if I can offer you a, uh, a snack or a beverage, just let me know. <laughs> oh, thank you for the hugs, Dragoon. Alright. Journal. Bit of a way away, but we shall wander in the rain. And while we wander, let me tell you about some mechanics of this game that I've discovered since the, uh, the last time we were playing it. Whoops. So. Flint. Ooh, Jesus. Sorry. Knocked my microphone stand. Flint is only needed when it's pissing rain like this for the fires, but otherwise fires are your friends as are the 
companions that you will meet that are, have the option for you to like rest and meditate at their place. So basically everything in this game is dependent on time. When characters appear, when certain monsters appear, when certain quests are available. It is all dependent on time, which is a very old school concept. This is going back to the time where there were no teleport points. There was no fast travel. There was no... this Meditating is essentially the kind of fast travel you can do to get through time. But you essentially have to pay attention to the little... Hold on, the little map in the top corner here. It tells you the time that when you meditate, so it's like in six hour stints, but their story and the characters appearing and things being available is so heavily reliant on the actual time of day in this game. And even if it's fucking like, quests will tell you someone is somewhere, but they won't be there. They'll be wandering around the city. And so a lot of the time you have to take your own initiative. One of the other old school elements is the fact that I had a quest the other day spoke to a gentleman and he was like, oh, well, I'll give you this thing in exchange for some dwarven alcohol. Now, see, case in point, he's not, where the fuck is this guy? <laughs> give me a second, I'll finish my... He wanted dwarven alcohol in exchange for something, but it didn't come up as an actual side quest on my journal, on my map, nothing. So it was because I paid attention to him during that cutscene, and then I went and bought dwarven beer. I even tried to give him red wine, he's like, what's this? It is time gated, so um, that NPC, the grave digger, doesn't appear at night time, he only appears during the day. Spoke to him, he mentioned dwarven beer, so then I went and bought some, took it back to him and it advanced the quest. Didn't even come up in the journal as an actual, like, you come here, you can track things, whatever else, but just because it says that Vincent is here, doesn't mean that he is because it's night time and it's raining would you still be at work if it was night time and raining no so that's what i actually it clicked with me and i was like i've been playing this game all wrong you've actually got to play it a certain way so then sometimes the marker will be like underneath and he'll be actually like in the dungeon here or like underneath something but a lot of the time if it's a certain time of day they're not going to be aware because would you look now we're in the sewers pretty sure he's not down here I'll tell you what it is though motherfucking drowners i've been working on my weaponry let's go y'all want some wait for you to jump in the water So the swamps is pretty much like the only other place you can travel to in this game at the moment once you're like kind of into the story. Um, so the swamps are kind of dangerous. You want to be like leveling stuff up. Like that's kind of a good thing about how slow this game is at the at outset because you really can't get through certain parts of things unless you have like your skill trees upgraded so it is actually forcing me to play it in like a really think heavy old school way like even now i'm concerned about collecting brains because i know that one of my side quests somewhere is probably going to require a brain <clears throat> Um, the combat in this game, you really have to kind of get familiar with certain, like, there will be three different NPCs and all three of them will require a different fight style if you take them on individually or you can do group, but it really depends on what you, like, spec into sort of thing. Um, so you really have to pay attention because skill points aren't super prevalent in this game and so far I haven't really found a way to kind of, um... Oops. I really haven't found a way to sort of surpass that through like potions or, you know, stuff you can buy. It's mainly like runes and upgrades for your weapon you can buy. Nice. <clears throat> so we are just going to explore the sewers a little longer, get some more brains. 
some more of these things because I know the alchemist wanted something. Um, nice. Um, well, how the fuck do we get out of here? I think there's a door around here somewhere. Um, when you also you end up running around the map so many times that you just naturally become like familiar with like your bearings. See something like that, you'll randomly collect something and it'll finish a quest. All right, exit to Temple Quarter. Oof. Sorry, scrunching my water bottle. Looking good, Geralt, as always, my white wolf. Slashing like a seasoned killer. Sorry, I just had to mute myself to cough. I think I am actually getting sick. So I'm going to have to go and um, put a mask on tomorrow and go do some side question quickly before I get any more ill. Make sure I've got myself some antibacterial fucking strepsils or some shit. I can't afford for my voice to go. My literal job is my voice. Um, need permit. Uh, Thayla said the city guards. Um, right, so... Oh yeah, I also did an autopsy on a dead body, which was kind of explaining that, like, the guy was poisoned by the cold, and they were, some, the alchemist I was working for was trying to blame it on them, but it was actually the alchemist I'm working for, so everyone's kind of against each other. As Ajaved, that's the alchemist we're looking for. Um, so, alright. Alright, cool. So since it is night time and the grave digger's not up until the morning, we can go see the detective. Because he'll be in his place. We'll go see him. And talk to him about the, um... Talk to him about the autopsy. Raymond, Mr. Monocle, we have come and we need your assistance. Oh, oh. very nice little fish dinner, ladies. He keeps a nice house and he's and he cooks. <clears throat> Raymond, I know you're asleep, but I need to speak to you. Yes. I have the autopsy results. I have the autopsy results. And? I'm certain it was Kalkstein. How do you know? The liver was cirrhotic. The stab wounds were just a clumsy attempt to hide the real reason. So <laughs> poison <laughs> after all. But how can you be sure it was Kalkstein? Ah, oh, poison, is it? Changes in the eyeballs. Typical of alchemical poisons. And the tongue was homework. necrotic. I sure did. Come back later. I need to analyze this information. Okay. Nice, that's that quest updated. Not now. But I need to rest. Oh. Well, normally. You can speak to one of those NPCs and they'll allow you to rest in their home, but unfortunately, he's kicked me out. Oh, Alan. Hi, Alan. I'm so sorry I missed you in chat. Alan, how you doing? Welcome to the stream for the evening. Signal. Oh. I like it when people in chat have things that they like. Equally. Oh, hello. You need my steel sword. Assassins generally require quick combat. Which is the cat style. So you see the way he holds his sword changes? So this is wolf which is heavy. Second one, oop, Geralt, how dare you. Second one is cat, which is quick, and then this is group, so 
up, down, 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 down. So you just gotta change them depending. Um, alright, let's, oh, where are you going? And he can spin now, look, Wee. Hold me closer, time to dance, oh. Uh. the headlights on the highway. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, I also bought alcohol because Shani has suggested something a little funky funky. Hello, precious. Do you go upstairs? Oh, good luck with your learning, Alan. Best of luck. I'm sure you're going to absolutely knock it out of the park. Hopefully I can be good background noise. Sh well. Shani. <clears throat> oh. Yes. Hi, Shani. 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 I wanted to talk. Oh, did you know? <laughs> what is it? Sometimes I dream about the Battle of Brenna. I know sorry. I've talked but to you about this before. Uh, Thanks. Don't mention. It. I I need to. D hello. Don't. Well, can I lie down too? Cause I need. Hey, lady. Lie. Yes. The nightgown, though, for those shiny lovers in the house. I wish I'd crush that up for her. She suggested something... ...funky. Which I'm game for. Alright, we are going to meditate till dawn. Pretty sure that should bring out Zikoyev de girl. I'll tell you this for nothing, it's really handy having this little timer app on my phone growing the plant as well because it's right in front of me so I'm kind of keeping track until the next time I need to take a break. Um, so for anyone who does study or um, even stream, if you do anything with you, for an extended period of time and you want to make sure that you don't touch your phone but you also get rewarded for not touching your phone, I highly recommend an app called forest literally it's just called forest it is free to download it is relatively free to use you can also earn coins to, like get these other little plant things but it's really satisfying to see it like watching in front like growing in front of you if you don't touch your phone so i mean if you leave then it dies <laughs> so i highly recommend um downloading our forest app if you want like a cute little timer that actually you feel like rewards you as well and keeps you off your phone so all right let's go talk to this guy who's here now it's dawn so he's started work hello how did things go at the warehouse once i left quickly good i admit i was hoping for a bit more but it's always a few bandits less that's the last time you use me i'm not a general avenger had no I choice. ain't your Believe meat shield. Me. It won't happen again. You have my word. I Better not, Captain America. Investigation. <laughs> Don't have a choice. I can't help officially, but I'll lead you to it. Anything you learn, I'd be glad to hear. Hmm. Well, first, can you get me a pass into the cemetery? Can you get me a pass into the cemetery. You accuse me, and then you want help. See it as a way to prove your innocence. Mm -hmm. Not a chance in hell. Get lost. Mm. Steady. I won't help with this vigilante investigation. The oh. results are crap. He's in on it, I bet. Well, then let's talk about Salamandra. I wanted to talk to you about Salamandra. Okay. Someone informed them about my cockatrice contract. What are you suggesting? That you're in on it. With everything. Several possibilities, mostly Several pointing possibilities, at you. Mostly pointing at you. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna explain mm -hmm. myself to you. Hmm. You let the professor out of prison. His bail was paid. That's the law. I get it. Observe the law at all costs. But you can bend the law. But you can bend the law. I don't tell you how to hunt monsters. You don't tell me how to do my job. Yo, Alan, I'll let's go. Out. Hopefully the app helps you. I, I think it's it's I think it's pretty good. But 
Occasional ads, but mostly ad free. End a conversation. <laughs> what do you do nights? Yay! Meet your boss, Azar Javed. Nothing unnatural about spending nights in the trade quarter. Is there something unnatural about a man? <laughs> There's something unnatural about a man shoving his bolus inside a guitar and strumming himself to ecstasy. <laughs> Where do you get gold for that? Where do you get gold for that? Don't always need coin to get by. Wealthy friends. I've got no real Back alley coin, hand so I'll have to wait to decide. <laughs> Sounds like your mountain has turned into a molehill. That's what happens when amateurs try their hand at serious work. If you stumble upon any real leads, come by. I'll give you some useful advice. Dude's a, dude's a blood holy on a half. I need more evidence to accuse the booze hound. Get out of my way. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go see the grave digger. I relatively know where he is. But luckily I can track the quest. Let us go. Um, update, I learned some extra herbalism skills. I upgraded my skill trees a little. There's still stuff I can't, like, it's unknown. But mostly now I can actually, like, harvest um, and do ubalism stuff for my alchemy. This guy, Zoltan, I've not been able to beat him, like, successfully more than, like, once in a game of poker. So let's quickly play a game of poker with him. Time for an absolute banger. Welcome to the dice song. <laughs> I got a pair, but I'm confident that we can come through with a win. Well, let's get rid of this one, this one, this one. Come on, God, gods and goddesses, give me some good dice. Fuck! Pain in my ass. Welp, we've lost this one. Oh, thank you, dragon, Kitsunesa. You're going to absolutely love the Kitsune artwork and audio that I have coming out during the subathon. Yo, the dice music's a fucking banger. Makes me ben -in, ben -in, ben -in, 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 in That bit how gets me like shimmying in my chair. <laughs> Alright, what have we got? I got ones and threes. But he's got twos and sixes. No, nah, nah, bruh. Oh no. No, <laughs> shit me. Alright, that's fine. It's pretty much one already, but it's fine. We move. <clears throat> you lose. Fuck you, dwarf. You've taken so much of my gold. <laughs> It's a fucking bop. Absolute tune. Oh no, Cleo. The condensation. <laughs> I know you do love them, don't you, dragon? Well, not even I know what the Kitsune audio will contain right now, but I do have the Kitsune artwork in my hot little claws, and I can tell you all this for nothing, y'all are gonna love it. Oh, it's so good. What do you need? What do you need? Now this man's been through the ringer, needs a face mask and a half. Um, so, I'm here about the notice, about notice first. Yes. I've got your jugs of dog lard. Oh my god, it makes me sick. I understand you need six jugs of dog's lard. I want you to call as many muck. Mm -hmm. I'm here. Yes. Okay. I, have... I use the lard on the cask. Okay, great. Thank you so much for the payment. I would like to get inside the cemetery, but I still cannot. I 
want to get shitty. How can I? I need no other way. Actually, I have a terror. I was right. Bye, long. Alright, bye, well. Cool, we got money for that. Um, there was another. Oh, yeah. Um, hold on. Captain Mice. I don't know the fuck he is. Yeah, that's pretty fucking far away. Alright, what other quests have I got that might be a little closer? No, nah, he's not any closer. Um. Oh yeah, and then Captain Moist. Okay, so I just spoke to him and he won't give me a thing to get into the... Oh my god. Okay. None of these are allowing tracking, which is annoying. All right. <clears throat> Looks like we're gonna have to go across the city. The first thing we are going to do is this one. Let's go. Do 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 do. Um, speaking of audios, guys, I do have my new audio coming out tomorrow. I will be recording, editing, and uploading it all tomorrow, um, tomorrow night or, no, nah, definitely tomorrow, because it's Thursday. So that's going to be part two, that, uh, part four, sorry. It's going to be part four of the... Cursed Royals Apprentice series. I believe it's powerful. Um, so if you haven't already listened to the series, it is available on my YouTube channel under the um, Cursed Royals Apprentice. Like it's actually got a playlist now, I think. Shani, are you home? Or are you with the hospital? Yes, thank you, Granny. Hello. Thank you. I do not need your sandpapery tones in my ears. Uh, Shani, are you here? Uh, nope. Fucking unreliable hull as usual. Alright. Can't do my quest with her. Let's do the Kalkenstein one. That's basically what it's like in this game. You just have to he can choose what fucking even talking to this herbalist lady and then I gave her something and she told me where to get stuff like it's weird how certain dynamics work in this game if you talk to certain people um this one's close let's go here do 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 <laughs> I should not have that stupid dice music stuck in my head. <laughs> no ringtone. Monkey man. I suspected you were working with Javed. Oh wait. I'm here. You have Do I know I know I will No. Uh, no. Okay. I don't Hmm. Wait. Show me your wares before I accuse you. What have you got? Ah, uh, necrophages, al ghouls, scimitars and devourers, ornithosaurs. Spectres, Noon Wraiths, Night Wraiths, and this one is... Oh, Basic Minerals. Which can be bad to that. Okay. That's kind of good. Uh, basic... I've already read this. Okay, that's fine. Um, what can I sell to him? I kind of just need to go through my actual... Wait, do you want these? I don't know if they're going to be for a quest or something. I'll sell them to you. Later, fam. Alright, what is this? Uh, already read it. 
a drown a repelling talisman. Hey, oh, there you go. That's kind of good. For moving through the shrimps. 400 buckaroonies, though. Goodness gracious. Alright, I don't think I need any of... Oh, I thought that's a dwarven spit. I was like, ew. Why would you want that? Um, alchemist, alchemical brand. I don't think I've seen that before, so I'll get some of that. Get some of that. Hmm. I'll buy that. I'll buy that. It's good to have this stuff for the potions. Vitrio. Ah, oh, very good. The rest of the stuff I've kind of got plenty of, like... Wait, Weinstone? Do I get... Harvey Weinstone. Chaplin says just wait till you get... <laughs> no, there's, there's more banging dice music. God help me. Well, I'm gonna make it through. Well, that should do me from this game. Hmm, mm. sorry I got lost in thought. Ah, you're the bad guy. I suspected you were working with Javed. You think I lead Salamandra? I'll die laughing! I'm certain. You don't fool me with your scholarly guise. I'm certain. You don't fool me with your scholarly guise. You're a fool, Geralt. I should keep an eye on Calcstein. Is there a new quest? New quest? You offended me, Witcher. Okay, well, so is Monkey Man. It's a good thing I bought from you before I offended you. <laughs> and also, you want to be saving a plenty in this game and consistently checking random fucking trunks and barrels for random things because you never know what you're going to find. Um, ba -da -ba -da -bump. and the amount of times that I've gone into somewhere and there's been one item I didn't take and it was the item I needed. Oof. Right, I would like to leave your house now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah, <laughs> oh my god, that's why this music is Irish all stuck in my head. There's a joke. Joke, bro. Alright, um, game of dice. I've really got no one else that I can kind of... Round dead tongues. This can only be completed if the bestiary contains an entry about drowned dead. I see. Alright, I can opt. Oh, they, those have been the hard things to um, kill in the shrimp. Alright, well, let's just stick to the main quests. Cool, there's one more of these available. So let's go buy it from the guy. Because I think that's how you get them. <clears throat> the neighbor's laundry is getting mm, thank you for the stretch dragon. I am excited to play The Witcher 2 and I'm actually like, now that I've sat down and sort of figured out the mechanics of this game and I've got it a little more sorted, it's a little less frustrating. Um, I also think it's kind of good to have games like this on days where I'm not feeling like super energetic or actually because you can't always be super high energy and doing everything for everyone all the time so sometimes it's nice just to have one of these games where the whole point is just kind of running around yes similar to Skyrim not so annoying show me all words what do you have Alright, never mind, get out of my way. Um, ferryman, I need you to take me somewhere, please. Uh, there you are. Ferryman. Trans take me take to the other side, times. please. I'm ready. How many? Much more streamlined, yeah. I've, I've um... I've experienced a lot of the clunkiness in this game. 
but it's kind of also giving me like a nice feeling of nostalgia now because of the clunkiness. Um, so I am glad I'm playing it and pushing through because I do still, I'm kind of grasping the story. And also because I've watched like the Netflix series, I kind of have a concept of like what's sort of gone, but at the same time, yeah, still, <laughs> I don't know, I'm having fun with it. So thank you back it out with me guys in which we play the witcher. Good sir. Do you need a boat? Good sir, do you need a boat? Well I just got off the boat. I fresh off the boat. Get myself prepped for the next battle. Get out of my way. Oh, Ratty Rooski, Dooski, this guy. No, wait. Do, 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 do. Hello, Bashko. That's a nice statue. Well, um, maybe this is not where I need to be. Whoop. Do we need to get behind the house? There we go. Yeah, that is where I needed to be. Hmm. Why is this highlighted? Sephira and Arbalus have merged. Oh, there we go. Say random shit like that and it'll activate a fucking quest. The cool. seems ancient. All right, well, obelisk activated, it would seem. We came here for someone, and they're not here, but then we started another fucking quest. Well, that's funny, because, yeah, there's one of those things over here as well, so let me hold up, hold up, hold up. A goose? There's a goose on the loose? Wah, 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 Remember to import my save file? Oh, good idea. Good idea, good idea. Okay, I don't have the thingy for this one. Yo, and I'm down to triple digits of my coins. Eh, no, I'm poor. Fool's parsley. I have a feel. Um, alright. There was another obelisk around here somewhere at the back. I loved the Vulpix plush, Kirby, by the way. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining me. Yes, I did see you posted it in the banter channel. It was very cute. So bright as well. I would imagine it would give me energy just looking at it. He is Rounders, get out of my way. Oi, cha. Don. Don Zoi. Can I loot the remain? Oh, it's because this thing's coming towards me. Get out of my way, you weird squishy thing. <laughs> I hate the weird squishy thing. <laughs> oh. Right, that should be all of them now. Thank you. And then it's like skinnable items available. I'm like, I want to skin a drowner, please. Oh no, I can't harvest my herbs, bro. <laughs> They're wibble wobbling all over the place. Now can I get my herbs? Oh nope, apparently not. Everything is going to prevent me from gardening today. There we go, see if you're in the wrong swords. Ooh, fuck. <clears throat> All right, potion. What have I got? That's anti. Uh, was that acid or poison? Like, 
I'm gonna use it right now. Hang on. There we go. Alright, so I gotta like kill it and then run away from it. Run, run, run! Before he explodes! Before he explodes! Alright, I've got nothing to restore vitality, but I am alive, so that's a good thing. Tell you what, man, this swamp fagin' hates me. But yeah, they do look like a little mini Godzilla, don't they? Alright, let's make our way back to the obelisk so we can sit by the campfire and heal. We'll also create a couple potions and see if we've got skills we can upgrade. Get away from me, Drowner. I'm always dead, man. Help me, brick maker. He just starts walking away from me. Fucking classic. Oh, there's Vaskar, you old kent. Want to ask something? Um. Kalkstein, an alchemist, actually, before we ask questions, show me your words, because we all know how this goes. I end up offending people. Give me all your cheese. <laughs> I end up offending people, and then they're like, go away! Goose fat. Chicken leg would eat. Cherry spirit cordial would drink. With a chicken sandwich. Uh, yup. Alright, she's literally got nothing else that I could want or need. That is absolutely fine. I better not sell in it because I don't know what alcohol of mine is for my fucking quest. <laughs> With, um, Shani. We have, have much problems. problems. Indeed. Creatures have made nests in the clay pits. Killed them all. What are they like? As if drowned, then resurrected. Drowners. Killed them all. We're poor folk. That's enough. Towards the land. And I killed them all, and I could have gotten paid 50 orins for it. Yo. <laughs> I've killed, I've killed drowners. You showed us mercy, yet I deceived you. We'll Good do. thing I didn't Wonderful. go do it. Who are we worship them and I keep thinking of the fish people, Vodjinoi. How Vodjinoi. dare you? Those names offend the lords. See, all I do is offend people. Later. Oh no! Yo, she did give me a Sephiroth for my quest though. Let's fucking go. Thank you, old lady. Return later. That's fine by me. Oop. I'm gonna meditate anyway. Skills, none. Zero. Uh, up me, there we go. Sorry. Alright. What do I... I think it's... Hmm. I can't remember which potion it was that slowed down time. Blizzard! Blizzard, blizzard, blizzard! <clears throat> Um, alright, I've got plenty of that. Um, let me do this so then I can make another one. Golden Uri Uri. Um. Because they're handy to have. They're handy as fuck to have. Alright, cool beans. Um, come back later. Where are we now? Uh, what is later? Next day, sort of ish. Okay. Popeye's chicken sandwich, skill zero. <laughs> That's why I'm fainting for chicken sandwiches, because my skill is lying eating food. <laughs> Alright, we're all healed up. Potions are done. Which looks nice. Alright, Valka. Uh, oh, Vaska. <laughs> Probably help if I got a name right. <laughs> Hello. The Water Lords and I. I am a Water Lord. Let's discuss a job. Let's discuss a job. Please help. 
One of our children is missing. Perhaps the water beast ate him. Uh -huh. Blasphemy. The druids must have him to transform into a dryad. All right, I'll look for the boy. I'll look for the boy. Uh, ask the druids about the missing boy. I, why are you two just mummies, boys? All right. Um, let's quickly go do that because I've wanted to meet these druids. See, it's in the zone that we don't know, and it's near an obelisk as well. Let's fucking go. Ready for an adventure chat? Ready for an adventure? We're going on an adventure. We're going on an adventure. And it's gonna be fun because we've got kitties with us. Meow, 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 meow. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I mean, the best thing to do is just kind of cut through, really. I've never been one for... I mean, I'm gonna get attacked on the path regardless, I mean, so I just fucking cut through. So yeah, I've killed so many fucking drowners, I am sick of killing yous. I am to make my way through the swamp, around the Godzilla people, and the drowners. There's the obelisk, okay, mark. We've never come this far before. Look, there's a corpse. What are you doing? Oh, oh. Nobody come for me because I looted a corpse, okay? That's what RPG. Mm, ah, fuckers. That's what RPGs are all about. I should see if our Builder Bear offers something similar because we do have Pokemon come through our Builder Bear place. Um, it's I don't think I've ever seen an, a lot of Vulpix, and that Vulpix was really like bright as well with the full coat. I'll have to check because um, I put a Nightmare Before Christmas plushie on my throne once and someone gifted it to me so I could do a similar thing with the Vulpix if I ever found one but I mean if I ever found one I'd just be there like making it myself like <laughs> stuffing it full of stuffing like good in there Ooh, big man big 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 Odd place looks like these giants froze mid motion must have been some time ago okay I don't know why it wants me to give it things. Pylon? Well, let's Frankenstein and bring it to life, shall we? Come alive, Gollum. Do you want some cheese? <laughs> oop. Oop, that did something. That fucking almost killed me. Are you kidding me? Ah. <sighs> This game. Oh dear god, it costs that much. Oh, it's an online exclusive. Yo, I'll tell you when it comes to the Pokemon merchandise, they can literally just charge whatever the heck they want. But you've given me the idea. Like, I'm actually going to keep my eye out for, like, a little, um, a Vulpix plushie if they come through my Builder Bear. Marshland. We have discovered a new area. Can't believe that lightning bolt. What? Zeus bloody hated me today. I need more of this power play. I need a campfire. Elder druid. We met the druids. These trees, strange symbols, tamed beasts, even a dryad. This must be the druid's grove. Nice. We made it to the druid's grove. Hello. What? I thought his name was Warren. It's a wyvern. 
I thought it... Get out of my... I've been sniffing there, Warren. <laughs> White mud. Oh, we made it to the druid place. I don't have anything for this obelisk. Logger. Ooh. Jesus Christ, YouTube is going to... Oh, okay, I can go. Uh, give me a sec. Huh? <laughs> Build a NASA, yes. Alright, y'all get the audio, but I can't uh, allow this on YouTube. <gasps> Wind blade. She is. Oof. Wind blade. What's that mean? <clears throat> You know me? Your name precedes you. Gwyn Blade no means more. White Wolf. I remember nothing of my past. Some things are better forgotten. Nevertheless, I do feel sorry for you. She is naked. As Sad naked man. as the day Perhaps she was born. She is a very naked oh, elf with her very green nipples out. For now, I can show you this because she is covered. But I swear to God, if it goes back to the boobies, I'm... Because she's fully, like, not even a loincloth. All right, wait. Kirby says, it's not just the plush. It comes with a six-in-one sound box. Ah, oh, and a sleeper cape for it. Oh. Yo. That kind of justifies the price, I guess. But still, but still. I wouldn't even trust anything with a sound box around my phone. <laughs> oh, God. Druids don't believe in clothing. Well, that is fine, but the old old men druid were wearing capes, which I'm thankful for. <laughs> this lady's walking around looking fine as fuck. Tell me about Brokilon. Oh, yep. Sorry. These women. Our archers are matches, <clears throat> but how long can we resist the brute force that rendered humans the world's rulers? Say sorry, can't, 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 cannot trust a dang thing. Go to the website to hear the sounds. Okay, Bert. I'm gonna have to do some research. Um, so you agree with the elves and dwarves fighting for independence? So you agree with the elves and dwarves fighting for independence? Those children? They have long forgotten the struggle's meaning, craving blood and revenge. Right, and next. That's why I had to bring they you back to, to this see, screen. They to humans themselves. We merely defend our home, Gwynblade, and have no ambition of driving humans into the sea. Wowza. <laughs> um, why don't you reach a compromise with the humans? Why don't you reach a compromise with the humans? Ha! Huh. You treat concessions as weaknesses and believe acts of goodwill are traps. You will never accept our otherness. Yeah, I can't because every time I bring you back, like she's here and then I click an option and it pans out. And she just, it's, it's all, plus she looks high as a kite. Excuse me, lady. Look, look. I like to enjoy the long bottom leaf as much as the next person, okay? <laughs> but y'all gotta invest in some clear eyes over here, because it's for realsies. <laughs> Sheesh! <laughs> oh my high go finally has its tongue out! Oh my god, guys, look, 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 look! I never activate. I never actually get to activate my high go face with its tongue out, so I don't know why it is now. But look, nah. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> but this is my proper high go toggle. We'd never get the tongue out. <laughs> Two extra wrists. Oh, thank you for the hydrate, Jack. Can <laughs> we do that now? <laughs> oh my goodness. <clears throat> Ooh. I'm sorry guys. Don't tell, tell me about your lives. lives. Brokilon is our home, Ithlin our lady. We live in harmony with the forest flowing through the thickets and knowing the forest. Damn girl, nice wrist. 
Like humans, we have joys and sorrows. Oh, Polly, you like the high go tongue? Yeah. <laughs> the war with the humans continues, and our numbers diminish. We love the Mlem. We're here for the Mlems. Mlem. <laughs> Tell me about Brokilon. Tell me about Brokilon. Brokilon is the dryad homeland, mm -hmm. a wilderness untouched by humans. Sounds cool. Those surrounding Brokilon wish to claim our forests, and thus humans and dryads fight continuously along the borders. Who is winning? Our archers are matchless. But how long can we resist the brute force that rendered humans the world's rulers? Um, that's sad. that's sad. Right, now that she's off of the screen, I can bring you back. <laughs> Come back. <clears throat> right. I can give you a quick flash of her from a distance. She's over there somewhere getting all naked. Alright, let's see if... Alright, yeah, I don't have the thing. Sorry, repeating myself. Don't have to think for that. Oh, wolf! Howdy! Hello, sir. What's your name? I... Oh, it was very fierce. I wasn't very friendly at all. <clears throat> Alright, who do I need to speak to around here, please? To whomst Elder Druid? Elder, sir, you. You? What is it? What is it? See, I'm glad he's not the naked kind of druid. God damn. Oh, fire and fluffy. <laughs> fire and fluffy. Aren't those wyverns? Wyverns indeed. Wyverns indeed. Mastered. Tamed them through hard work. I guarantee they're not drugged or their wings clipped. See for yourself. Any accidents? Only the fool who tried to brush a wyvern's teeth. Only the fool who tried to brush Any his other teeth. Why do it sound like you come from central Wales? <laughs> Show me your ways. What have you got? Fainwear? Habarium. Sheriff, the prices of these books are bloody expensive. Yo, increase this maximum ju- Yes. We'll buy it. You see, that's the kind of shit you gotta look out for. Stuff that it permanently increases things and it'll just randomly be some old dude in the forest that throws it to you like, there you go. Bloody enjoy it. <laughs> Thank you. What is it? He looks like Saddle Martin. Oh, that was just about No, I don't want to sell that. Alright, cool. Now I've got nothing to sell. Thank you, old man. Um, you're just a standard druid, but you look what as old it? as the elder I one. I seek a boy missing from the brickmaker's village. Hmm. I've not seen him. The brickmakers claim Strange. you changed curious, children I'm curious, to dryads. Fools! Only adults are accepted here. Children would only trouble us. As for dryads, ask them yourself. Farewell. Right. Sort to the dryad about the kidnapped boy. Even the devs know- yeah, they- They were like, we want to be true to culture, but not that true that it like stops. But we want, we want to be this kind of true to culture. <laughs> not the old wrinkly ball sack kind of true to culture. Yavin. Welcome to the Druid's Grove, traveler. See, he's fully clothed and armored. Don't even sell me on Druid's being naked. And the peacefulness helps clear my mind. Even a witcher is welcome here. One more word about my accepting my otherness and finding the home I never had and I'll cry like a baby. <laughs> Sarcasm only serves to expose your inhibitions. Ooh, an elven psychoanalyst. Ooh. I spent decades among humans. I find your kind as complicated as the schematics of a flail. Oh Decades. yeah, thank you. Live that long among humans, you're bound to become more like them than you ever wanted stretch. to be. Stretch. I will be getting Are up for a stretch in just a moment, Monster Dragon. Slayer? Thank you. A sharp wit. I'm Geralt. My name's Yavin. Because I just talk. grew a plant, yes. so it's been my uh, my 60 minute timer. <clears throat> I'm looking for witches' work. I'm looking for witches' work. Then I'll ask you a favor. 
I need a letter delivered to the Zima. Okay. Where I'm not welcome. I can Who's do that. the letter to? I'd be obliged if you could deliver oh, yeah, it to Vivaldi. Vivaldi. I know him. I'll do it. I'll do it. Thank you. You're going in there anyway. Oi, you get back here. What can you tell me about your kind? What makes you elves tick? What can you tell me about your kind? What makes you elves tick? Hmm. Let us pray beneath the trees for the trampled heather, for blood that has been shed, for fate that has been destroyed. Nice and to the point. Farewell. Nice and to the point. Farewell. What about Holio? <clears throat> Ow, I just smacked the desk with my hand and knocked one of my nails. That kind of hurt. Oh, this is pretty. Circle of unwanted power. Hello. Oh, I'm going to save before I touch this thing because if it kills me, oh my god. <laughs> Oh yes, we just learned a new sign. Erden. Erden? Magic trap that slows your opponents. Nice. <clears throat> we learned a new sign, everyone. Let's go. Erden. Erden something in Inden. Din 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 din. Oh, oh, wolves, that's good. I actually need your pelts. I need your pelts. I'm so sorry, wolves. Do you need heavy? I think you need heavy. Oh, we're doing group. We're doing group. Oh, I'm so sorry, wolves. Oh, I'm so, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm normally a dog person, I swear. I'm so sorry, I'm normally a dog person. I'm a dog person. Oh my god. <laughs> if no if no one else wants it, I'll take it. What makes it unwanted? I want it. <laughs> it's free, isn't it? <clears throat> well. Wolf pelts. I need wolf pelts for a quest, so I'm so sorry, doglets, but I do actually need that for experience. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Any more wolfies? No. No lost children either. Oh, wolves. Thank you. No lost children either, so I'm not too sure where that lost kid has gone. Hello, wolfie. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh, shit. I can't deal with these noises. Come on, Geralt. Thank you. There we go. Oy. Traumatic and a half. I apologize, chat. That was some traumatic sounds. I don't know how many wolf pelts he needs, but he needed a fair few, so I'm just going to keep on collecting them until it says quest completed. Is that all of them? That's all of them. <clears throat> Alright, let's go back to the druids, see if we can't find this lost fucking child. He's like, I don't know, ask, ask one of the dryads. I'm like, I thought that's what you were. No, there's druids and dryads now, so I'll get it right. Get it right. What is it? Farewell. Okay. There's no one else fucking here, and I spoke to her already. Oh my god. Alright, give me a second, because I'm going to double check whether this lady is the one that I actually need to speak to about this kid quest. Which would be weird if it was, but ugh. Gwynblade. Gwynblade. There she is. Oh my god. I seek a boy. The brickmakers claim druids seized him. I seek him. a boy. The brickmakers claim druids seized him to transform him into a dryad. Only girls can be dryads. No boys here. No Just boys allowed. <laughs> I will show you where young dryads come from. But... Yes. I wish to remain faithful to the Brockelon. She's like, let me show you where they come from. <laughs> Opens her legs. Oh, God. And just the strong and agile. 
We want the girls born of their seed to inherit their father's fortitude. Makes sense. I've been accused of many things. But lack of physical prowess is not among them. I believe you. But the ritual requires a man to prove himself a skilled hunter. Bring me a wolf's pelt. Oh my god. Chat. Chat. Oh jeez. The sexy naked green lady is like, yo. We only like the strongest men to breed with. And Geralt goes, oh. I've been accused of many things. But a lack of physical prowess is not among them. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm losing it. And then she's like, okay, fair dues. You look good, but do the skills pay the bills? Bring me a wolf pelt, bitch. What were we just out there fucking slaying? Oh my god, I think slaying just got us laid. Let's go. I'm trying not to keep it for myself, but I also want to stay on YouTube. <gasps> Old lady, you are wrong, but thank you for sending me to the dryads. Oof. Okay, I'm looking for a wolf pelt right now. I've got skulls. I got flint. I don't want to give her the wrong thing. I just sort of admit, I don't know if I can. Even, oh look, I should be able to. I should be able to give you this because she's kind of hidden by the thing. Okay, she's hidden by the gift panel. <laughs> just don't pay attention to her. <clears throat> All right, I'm looking for a wolf pelt, which I swear to God I just had. Wolf pelt. All right, I'm not keeping all the fun for myself, but I also don't want YouTube to eat me. Oh God. Oh god. Oh god. What's that? Witchers are sterile. We dryads don't acknowledge intimacy without procreation. Oh <gasps> She was toying with us. <laughs> Polly, you got it in one. I know which sort I'd prefer. Hello? Sheesh. Intimacy without procreation can be good. Intimacy without procreation can be good. <laughs> hmm. Ha. Huh. Good. These are the options. He's like, sex without babies is good. She's like, why? First option. Option A. <clears throat> A couple entwined might mix the soil they lie upon, giving improved plant growth. Option B. Sex relieves stress, improves body and mind. Option option C. Sex is pleasure and pleasure is good. <laughs> yeah, we'll avoid this mining, it's okay. Yeah, she won't be getting what she wants, but I'm fin I'm out here trying to get what I want. Y'all don't think that I wanna be hello? Hello. She's gorgeous. Almost a, almost a disappointment that I cannot procreate with her. Thank you for the head patties, dragon. Alright, what are we picking? Option A, B, or C? Well, if you fuck on dirt, then the dirt grows stuff. <laughs> and so they go talk. Where are your qualifications, sir? I demand to see the qualifications. <clears throat> Sex relieves stress, improving body and mind. Sex relieves stress, improving body and mind. Hmm. We dryads must be vigilant oh. and agile to defend our home. Oh. And my body demands love. Oh. Would you like to be with me? <gasps> yes, for the day. For the day? For the, for the day. Oh, chat. All right, hold on. I can actually give you a little bit of this. Look at that. We scored. We made it. No, 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 no. That's all I can give you for now, because she's going to come back to the screen naked. Dude, we did it. Yay. All right. Now you can actually come back and stay here, okay? No more naked ladies. We talked to her and we finished the quest that we needed. And we totally hooked up with her. Grats chat. We just made it with a lady. I felt the earth move. I feel the earth move under my feet. 
We did it! We're real... We're real men and women now. We've made it with a dryad druid lady. We made it with the green lady. I'm an adult now. Ah, yes. Back to the good old, good old pile on fucking kill me central. No thank yous. No thank yous. Right, we're just going to make it back to the village basically so I'm in safety and then I will go to a BRB right quick so I can get up stretch and have a smoke. How are we feeling chat? Does anyone... Ooh! No! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no no no! Ooh! I don't have the thing for it anyway. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I'm gonna have to fight my way out. Oh god. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Oh god. I just came over to the obelisk. Because I thought I had the thing for it, but I didn't have the thing. Stop bullying me, I'll come. Mm hmm. Get the fuck out of here. Alright, anyone else? Anyone else? Anybody else want to interrupt my relaxing walk through the swamp? Hmm? Anyone else? Hmm? Anyone else? Didn't think so. <sighs> Guys, don't you hate it when you just go for like a relaxing walk through your local like monster infested swamp and the monsters attack you? Not cool. Not fun. It's <laughs> pressing all the wrong buttons and that as well. I just got freaked the fuck out. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> Alright, go on. Cross the pond. Across the pond we go. Oh, Axie's back, let's go. Hello, welcome back, little bro. <clears throat> Let God sort him out. I don't trust God to sort him out. I will do the sorting. I am the hand of justice. Hello? It's me. <laughs> be be Oh, cool. Thank you. It's me you should be worried about. I'm not trapped in here with you. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're almost back at the village. Oish. The brickmakers have made a little cult. Go away. Fucking Tweedledee and Tweedledum over here. God damn. Get out the fuck out of my way. Anyways, I'm just fine. Fucking chow right over here. <laughs> Sheesh. <clears throat> uh, guess who's on battlefield? Walker's in the building. Hello, Walker. Are you pew pewing to your heart's content? Have you got the day off? <clears throat> then post now clarity walks can be dangerous though. You're gonna take your pepper spray with you these days. Stretch. All right, yeah, I got you. I'm gonna go stretch. I'm gonna go hydrate. I'm gonna um offer y'all a little bit of a snack or a beverage uh, while I'm gone. Literally two minutes and I'll be back so <laughs> send him straight to me I'll teach him a lesson I'll spank him into line <laughs> all right sweet I shall return momentarily got out of work early says Walker oh nice say a happy birthday to your mum for me I hope she's feeling a little bit better and I'm glad you had a half day and you get to celebrate her birthday Celebrating it by playing Battlefield. <laughs> oh, Simp, just before I'm about to take a break. Hello, sweet thing. <clears throat> Thank you for joining me in stream this evening. My voice is failing, so I am currently going to um, stretch and hydrate. Oh, it's the, it's the brand new unreleased um, GTA 6, um, but instead of driving, you walk everywhere. <laughs> That's why it's unreleased. It's still working on it. <laughs> the graphics, though, A1. <laughs> learn from me. The only thing that you can learn from me is to take everything in life with a grain of salt and also make sure you are taking breaks regularly for your mental and physical health. Which means, physically, right now, I'll see you in two minutes.
Mentally, I'll discuss that later. <laughs> Stay right here. I'll be back soon. Okay, there we go. Sorry, I had to fuck around with the music. I was like getting so much in my headphones. I'm like, I have a stem sadra. All right, Gabby. I'm back and I have returned with honey chicken. I am more than happy for you guys to learn from me. I always want you guys to be able to, um, I always want you guys to be able to feel like this is a comfortable spot to not only flourish in your creativity, but also like learn new things that can, um, motivate you and in turn motivate others the video that i posted recently in the discord server in the band channel um actually kind of speaks on that sort of thing a little bit um how it's a, a trickle on effect how something that you learn you can then teach someone else 
Uh, which in then turn will teach and help other people. Womp womp womp. Y'all know the drill. Y'all are intelligent people. You know it. So thank you so much for the hugs, Dragon. I appreciate you, boo. Thank you for welcoming me back. Um, I'm going to put another half hour timer on my garden. Um, because I don't want the stream to go too over time tonight. I do actually need to get an early night. Because I've got a lot of stuff I've got to do tomorrow. And considering I've got to record the Cursed Royals Apprentice Part 4. And my voice is currently failing. I don't want to push it tonight. Um, but Walker, if you are still in the chat, um, can you let me know whether you are going to be on Battlefield all night? Um, also, thank you for the head patties, Viv. I appreciate you. And I appreciate all of you um, hanging out, keeping me company, um, going through this little little adventure with me, Intelligence. Good name, if I can tell you. In Teddy gents, what kind of men are they? <laughs> All right, let's talk to the old lady and let her know that she was being racist towards the druids. Thank you. I knew it was a cult. See, I knew. I knew, don't drink the Kool Aid, Vasca. Don't do it. The water lords and I. The water lords and I. Yeah, well, I'll tell you this for another old lady. The druids didn't take your boy, and if I find him, I'll see to his safe return, but. You's a liar. You didn't see me have side either and take a bite of my honey chicken, but I don't trust this bitch as far as I can throw her, stupid old lady. You want Russian accent? I give you Russian accent. The druids did not take your boy. If I find him, I see to his safe return. The druids didn't take your boy. If I find him, I'll see to his safe return. The boy is gone. A warning to all. We must prepare. Prepare for what? The end. The water lords and I. Oh god. I heard you first time you yelled at me, stupid old woman. Alchemist claims you know about Tower's Mage and Sentry, yes? Kalkstein, an alchemist, claims you know about the Tower's Mage and its Sentry. A powerful sorcerer once lived in the swamp. An apprentice his only companion. All changed when a woman entered his life. Oh. A fairy tale beginning. But the end differs. We knew it was gonna happen. What a wicked woman she was. Mm -hmm. He fulfilled all her wishes and she took advantage of his might. Who was women, am I right? Unimportant. Who was the woman unimportant? Flying love <gasps> spelled the mage's Assault. demise. Assault. He called upon forces he could not control and died. What about the guard? The mage's lover could tell fortunes and the mage created a deck of extraordinary tarot cards. He illustrated a future event on each card. And? Golems guarded the mage's dwelling. <clears throat> Guys, I swear it's not me. I swear to God it's not me. I was not the woman, I swear. Motionless. One of them is the guard? Yes, the most powerful golem acted as sentry. Oh, the, the golem thing. depicts how the golem can be revived. Yep. In turn, this will open the tower anew. Amazing. Card. I no longer need it. Thank you, so... A melanguale. Right, so here's the thing, chat. You remember how we went over to the golems before and we did those pylons and we got electrified and it wasn't a good time. Right, now. The tower card signifies destruction. Yes, of a physical tower, but it's more of an energetic thing. A destruction of something that was not built on a strong foundation to begin with. But classically, in the tower card, it is literally a bolt of lightning coming down and striking hence the tower. Hear about the notice. Do I have the pelts yet? Oh god, I still don't have enough pelts. I gave one to the druid lady and well, technically, I swapped a pelt for a fuck, so... Take me to the upside. What do you want me to do? In these times, in this financial climate, of course I'm going to pay for sex with a pelt. Let's go to, to town. <laughs> Oops, sorry, I forget the Russian accent. I total. Okay, let us restart the five minutes from now, yes? I totally forget about Russian accent. I do apologize. 
Just because they are praying to a bust of eldritch being does not mean they are part of cult. It's coincidence. I just stumbled upon a fancy birthday party. Nothing to be suspicious about at all. I apologize, but I had to walk. And if you heard me about, well, it's a thing. Girls don't think. Mr. President, please get out of rain and do not growl at me. I do not mean you any harm. Okay, so current quest, it tells me lost little lamb. Oh, goodness, I I was meant to find little boy. Well, we go back for him. It's okay. It's okay. There is quest that I swear I need to come back here for. Oh yes, we found a Vizima. There we go. Here we go here. We go to Vizima, we deliver a letter. I get sick of swamp. We go back to swamp later. Jean Pierre. <clears throat> Dragon wishes for Riz. Ah. Oh. It is always raining and pouring in this game. It is a poor comparison to how wet you make me, dragon. <laughs> the <gasps> as soon as I said it, the, the kitty is wet. I heard it, I heard it, we all saw it. I have proof. Old woman talk about wet kitty. I swear it is not just me. The game knows. It <laughs> It wants to help me with my riz. <laughs> Vivaldi, I require your assistance. Please chat, be ready for the beard physics. They're about to go off chops. What brings you here? I have a message from I have Yevin. A message for you from Yevin. Yevin? I don't need to read it. I know what he wants. Which I know oh my goodness, it make me dizzy. Uh, sh uh, uh, what? She dwarves? Gold power? Sh she dwarves. She dwarves. <laughs> How witty. Shove off. <laughs> Come back later for my answer to the elf. <laughs> <laughs> I love the way we're both gremlin laughing by the end. Oh my god, that's great. <laughs> oh, holy shit, dude. Alright, okay, Zoltan. Yes? Yo, chat, I think it's I think it's time for a little bit of a tune, don't you? Oh, 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 yeah, let's fucking go. <laughs> oh, the music makes me so happy. We've got a fancier table this time as well. Chat. We're fancy. We're moving up in the world. <clears throat> it's possessed by the, the spirits of old. <laughs> you just. <laughs> Are you gonna... Is, is a fist going to come out of your chin, similar Chuck Norris style, or... Are you cracking onto me? <laughs> is that like your tail wagging? When a beard... When a dwarf's beard does that, is that equivalent to a dog wagging its tail? <laughs> How am I so poor? I've only got 400 orins. I did win, though. That's something. Do you need to do... <laughs> it's a... <laughs> oh. <clears throat> oh, dragon, you're sweet. I'm generally pretty happy. There's a few things that make me laugh and giggle. Damn right, I've got a pair. I got a pair of cojones. I accept your bet, even though I'm poor, and I'm gonna move forward and roll these dice. I've got a lot to be um, happy about. Um, um. This music is one of them. <laughs> this should be my new BGM. Yo, what a hand we got. Three ones and two sixes. Let's go. Win again. Ooh, ooh, 
Yes, Zoltan. I oh, fuck you. I oh, fuck you. I am the poker champion. I mean, I made the A-line. If I wasn't a fiend with the dice, I'd be disappointed in my goddamn self. All right, let's go. I don't know how that like ranks me up in the dice matching thing now, but I feel good. That that's a, that's a one point towards my ego. Thank you for coming. All right, what is this one now? What is it? I'm um, to return to Vivaldi later. Right, right, right. Okay, is there anywhere around here I can? Detective, can I sleep here tonight? I need to return to the dwarf a bit later. Lady Ramon. Here at last. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Oh Listen, shit! I got it all figured out. Oh yep. Okay, Cal story. Cal rams me for associates. I have irrefutable evidence. What do we do with that information? We set a trap, though it might be dangerous. Gather your equipment and come back later. All right. Yes. Ga gather your equipment and come back later. <laughs> Like a um, like a chaplain, like a frill neck lizard. Like when Ben, when he gets scared, his beard just starts going crazy. <laughs> Wields weapons with his beard. He's got a, whole, he's got a blacksmith built in. He's got a built-in blacksmith in there. Oh my goodness. Okay, hold on. Ready for Ram's meat? Well, that's an invitation I don't want to put out very often. Um, I have a sus back. At where? Suspect, apparently. Um, I have a suspect. I have a suspect. Spit it out, Geralt. Hmm. Thaler or Captain? It's definitely Captain. Uh, Captain Vincent. Unlikely. Even if he was involved in getting the professor freed, that just makes him a crooked cop. But if he's taking bribes from Salamandra... Mm. In this town, only the fish in the lake don't take bait. Oh. And that's just because they're floating belly up. Without proof, he's a waste of our time. Let's focus on Kalkstein and Ramsmeat. Yeah, Bruce out here trying to be the next Davy Jones. <laughs> I wanted to ask you about the commander of the Royal Guards. I saw him in town some time ago, busy bashing perverts. Oh no, oh, he God. bashed me. <laughs> what don't you understand? Everyone knows the guard commander hates anyone he can call deviant. Everyone knows, but few care. Yes? I have a suspect. Spit it out, Geralt. The fence, taller. A mysterious fellow. He's liable to have his dirty secrets. We all do. It'd be good to know what he's hiding. But Ramsmeet and Kelkstein remain my chief suspects. Okay. <clears throat> Is there any flaw in his reason? Uh -huh. I'm ready for Ramsmeet. Good. He leads Salamandra's armed force. You have to kill him. <clears throat> Won't be easy, but I'll try. Won't be easy, but I'll try. All right, advancing in the story. Mere deduction. Yes. Oh, it's not giving me the option for sleepies. I need to sleep here tonight. We'll speak. He's not gonna let me stay with him. What a bodge job. Oh, lordy. Okay, all right. Well, we need to deliver this letter to the dwarf while I'm in town. So let's quickly go find a campfire. Um, which I'm fairly sure is this way. Give me a second. Also a very real possibility that Shani could be home, but also she is home at like weird hours, so we're not even going to pop on. We're just going to go straight to the pub. Which I think is down here. Fuck. Um, pub, 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 pub. Pub, 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 Shite. All right, hold up. Hmm. I've lost my way. I normally I know my way to the pub. <laughs> of course I do, because I'm a fucking Aussie. <laughs> Thank you so much for the head, patties. My ears nice and soft. Alright, so we gotta go this way and we gotta go down here. Now I know my way. 
All this tomfoolery just for a campfire. I thought flint meant you could like light a fire anywhere, but ever did No. I can't meditate with a fire out. I know. First. Kind of why? I got motherfucking flint out the wazoo. Oh, the ones I move, I've normally got flint out the fucking butthole. Do you think I can find it now? Um. Nah, no, no. I had so much flint. Where, where's all my flint? What is going on? Ah. Shite. Do I see you know? Where the Let's go pay for a room at the pub. Oh, some wholesome riz for next. I may like my plushies and my stuffies as much as the next person, but if there was anything comfy that I want sitting on my bed for me to snuggle over night time, it's you, Nex. <laughs> Orange. I'll take it. I say any rooms and he puts me in front of the fight. Any rooms? Yes. The back of the pub. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna meditate for a little while now. Let's see if we can make anything. Nah, uh, not necrophage maybe. Not much of nothing, but it is what it is. Um, what about skill points? Still zero. We love that for us. <clears throat> Let's meditate so we can go to speak to the dwarf about this thing in the chicken. Oh, shucks. You know it's true. I'm not sure that I'd be very warm or comfy being a lake succubus with horns. But I'll do my darndest. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure Valdi's house was this way, was it not? Hmm. Where's my cat? There we go. Be better today. <clears throat> okay, next deal. Absolute deal. <laughs> Speak to him and save the game. Be better day. I need to talk to you. What brings you here? Weem, boop, 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 boop. <laughs> Have you finished your answer to Yaven? Have you finished your answer to Yaven? Yes, here it is. The elf will surely reward you. Let's hope you're right. And he, oh my god, and then he just sh shimmies off, not a, not a step. The greatest NPC physics I've ever seen in my life. Ah. <sighs> we love old games. He's like, I have to go back. I need to return to my home planet now. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright. We need to kill Ram's meat. <clears throat> so, let's go do that. I'm also very curious. Just, I want to check in and see what time Shani is home. Because it's like right during the day, so... No, it's normally night she's home, I think. Okay, who's that? <laughs> Get out of my way, kid.
There we go, that one. Off we pop to go kill ram's meat. Of course you can, dragon. Of course. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah, well, I'll bash any kid that gets in my way. I'll yeet that child. What's out? <laughs> Fine to us here, he'd agree. <laughs> and plus, I have every right, because when I first started this game, one of those kids bullied me. And he was mean to me, and I Finally, don't like meal. it. Looking for something? I am. I need to get in. All right, go in. I'm about to pay you twenty dollars to go kill your master. Hope you're ready, mother. Hope you're ready, motherfucker. <laughs> I was like, "What am I I'm about ready to fuck it? It's just a mattress." <clears throat> what do you want, wolf? What do I want? Um, to kill you? Ah, how's things? Old whores have wings. Ah. Beaded witcher. I'm not even wearing my wings asset today, is sir. Can't I just like? Eh, eh. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, there we go. Oh my God. <clears throat> okay, so now we need. Now we need a potion. Potion. Endurance regen, acid, acid based. Hang on, where's my slowy one? I'm, a, I'm, I'm about to show you the benefits of my slowy potion, okay? If I can find it. Yeah. Ready, ready, ready? Oh my god. Right, watch me, I'm about to floop. <clears throat> floop away from these boys. Get myself onto the right sword. Oh. I did not expect there to be this very ready there. Okay. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Have I got anything that's going to increase my vitality? Uh, endurance regen. That's not much. Uh, we're gonna take the risk. Oh, we're doing it! We're doing it! We're taking the risk! We're risking it for the best cat! Let's go! Oh no! I think that just killed me. Oh fuck! Oh my god! Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That's fine. Now we know that there's about twenty men. 20 men in there. Now that's a gangbang I don't want to be a part of. Excuse me. No. I'm going to leave out of there right quick. Okay. Where did we load it at? Did I already get the answer from Vivaldi? Yeah, sweet. So yeah, even the reply. Alright, this is right before I went and killed him. Okay, maybe we need to level up before that. Maybe that's maybe that's going to be one of the last ones we do. I'm getting out of here. Yeah, me too, dwarf. I'm not dealing with that. Let's go talk to Monkey Man. <clears throat> the kids were your worst enemy when you played this. I'll block block you in. Oh no. No, that's the worst. They can. Did you? Were you here for that time? That kid just chased me. The NPC kid would just not leave me alone, and he followed me all around town. Get I was like, "Oh, don't return." That's pretty much what I said to him, but he wouldn't. Vasca helped me locate the tower tarot card. It describes how to wake the sentry. Vasca helped me locate the tower tarot card. It describes how to wake the sentry. Place a lightning rod on the sentry and wait for a storm. I must find a craftsman who will make a lightning rod for me. Well, I do have to go to the blacksmith anyway. Because... I do have to go to the blacksmith anyway because I've got some runes that I want to put on one of my swords. Well, that's right, the half elf wanted me to go see her at some point. Oh, 
How the fuck to get in there, though? Hold up. That door there, I think. Alright, we're gonna go down from there. Alright. Get out of my way! Stupid dwarf! <clears throat> Blacksmith first, then half-elf. Zoned out for a sec, what's up? Nothing, don't you worry. Don't even, don't even fret. Just crazy what beards. Just crazy, crazy, crazy beards. Hello, based. Aw, oh, thank you so much. I'm glad I can beat your silverhead princess. <laughs> Hello and welcome. How has your day been? Thank you for your hula video in the um in the uh, Discord. It made me smile. Show me your wares, Mr. Chive. Mr. Chive. All right. Um. Whoa, I can't afford this anytime soon. But that'd be lovely. Um, alright, so, I actually need to sell things. Because I don't know what the fuck I'm going to do with any of that. I don't really make bombs, so. Which is kind of a good thing, I guess. Um, alright, I haven't really used those whetstones, but that's fine. I need this blacksmith. Need some? Um. Will you Zoltan? Would you make me a lightning rod? Would you make me a lightning rod? A long metal. I know what one is. We use them in Mahakam when humans still pray to storms. How are you, based? I hope you've had a good day, though. Thanks for being Can you make here. A lightning rod? Are you trying to offend me, or can't you control what you say? I can, for fifty orins. Oh, fifty. Come back later. Okay, we'll come back later. It's in my money. I'm getting <clears> out of here. All right, how do I put my runes on my sword? So I thought I had to talk to you to do that. Uh, where are those rune stones? I had this one. Weapon upgrade. What on that? No, I know. I'd like, I'm pretty sure I've got to talk to him to get him to put that rune on my blade. <clears throat> nice work. They took it. The no. What? How? Will you Zoltan? There you go, I need my sword reforged. Thank you. Oh sheesh. <clears throat> I don't want to store anything though. Can't you just put the rune on that? Put the rune on this? Put this one on this? Can you do anything? I fucking hate dwarves. God damn! Alright, you know what? Never mind. Sod you, sod your fucking mate, sod this, I'm out, fuck this. We made good progress today though, we, we've made very good progress. Um, alright, so, let's get the fuck out of here. Come back later for the lightning rod. Let's quickly nip to the half-elves house, see if we can't get some more booty before we leave stream for the E. We already got some druid booty, let's go. <clears throat> I think I gotta go up this way to access her house. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, well, Walker, yeah, well, fuck you, Walker. <laughs> oh, God. Yes, I know, I know, I know. But then we play with... We, if you want to do deathmatch, then we get in straight away, and then you can play with sweaty mofos. Actually getting better, so I might be sweaty soon. <laughs> Indeed, your hips told me no lies. And, I mean, even if they were, they were sweet, sweet lies that I would listen to over and over again. <laughs> Free res. Um, for real though, no, thank you so much for sharing that. I do appreciate it. I am glad that you've got that part of your culture that you can kind of like be proud of and share. Because I've literally got barely anything Australian that I'm like proud of. Like, look at this, guys. <laughs> um, so it's intriguing me to learn more about it, and I do want to learn. Um, I do want to learn more about just different cultures and like history in general. But it's really fucking cool. Thank you. Half elf, Miss Lady. Greetings. Sadly, I don't speak the elder language. Big forehead lady. Pity, white wolf. Your language is like a stone axe. Ours like a beautiful Viriladan sword. Light in the hand as you perform palastras and crescent moon parries. Would you teach me? Learning requires time. A young mind can master our language in a few years. But learning palastras... I lost my memory. 
I may once have known your language. If true, perhaps you won't need to learn it anew. Hmm. I'll speak in Elven. Maybe you'll understand. Let's try it. Let's try. Esse Fenuwed. You are Fenuwed, the Sun Child. You are Fenuwed, the Sun Child. Fene means sun, wed, child. Mikeme is evo ni pont a Gwenelen. <clears throat> Do you come from the land on the river of Alabaster Bridges? You come from the land on the river of Alabaster Bridges. Oh, I need to forge a new sword in order to put the runes in it. Oh. Um, Incamine, I bathe my Gwynblade. I know that Gwynblade means me. I need to leave. Stu <laughs> Stupid white wolf. <laughs> Incamine. Oop. I need to leave. A bath may Gwynblade. Stupid white wolf. Vafail. Yeah. Farewell. I failed. Oh my god, we failed? No! No! Get back here! No! No, I'm, I'm, I'm reload my. No, I'm gonna reload my save because we need to learn the Elvish language. Are you kidding me? There's no way. Alright, Chaplain, thank you for the pro tip. So now that I'm hither, stupid blacksmith man, um, cabinet. Just got beer. Um, alright, so I need to forge a new sword. Maybe that's a quest later? Walk up. I'm gonna hit you over the head with my pet kangaroo. Oh, Hula was a really good replacement for church. Good, good, good. The Hula can become your church. <laughs> it is for the gods. <laughs> That's cool, though. I'm really glad that you could find something that um, you could actually um, still put that passion into and feel that connection, you know what I mean? Alright, so how do I forge a new sort of fuck noise? Alright, let's try... <clears throat> Let's try doing the uh, elvish quiz again, shall we? I'm determined to learn. Come on, Mr. President. Let's go learn elvish. My name is elvish, for God's sake, so it's not like I can't learn it. NASA means youthful one in Quenyan. Wrangled emu, no, but um, the place where I used to live, the suburb where I used to live, it was like near bushland and shit, and so there was actual like emus in people's front yards and whatever. And um, I have actually Jesus hit strange. one or two kangaroos on the road in like a four wheel drive and stuff. Um, we we hit one in my mum's car, which was like random one day, but like me myself, I've been in like another four wheel where we hit one. So I wrangled both. <laughs> I wrangled both. I don't speak the elder language. <laughs> <clears throat> Would you teach me? Learning I lost. If true. Let's try. Esse Fenuwed. You are Fenuwed. Fenuwed. Fen Mikeme is. You come from the land of Alabaster Bridges. You come from the land on the river of. Alabaster bridges. Jesus. Oh, you wanted the truth. I bath me, green blade. <clears throat> You're right. And Kamena, a dearth of love. The final age, Ted Dared. A bath. Oh, we passed. We passed. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um. Well. <laughs> <laughs> that's two for the books ladies and gentlemen two for the books two for the books two for the books let's go <gasps> high five me i just made it with a lady <laughs> oh base that makes me happy to heal 
I can't even compare hula, like my hula hooping to that, but I can kind of see where it gets the hula apart from. <gasps> Look, I'm gonna fucking kill you! Two kangaroos, one car, that's my new motto. Two kangaroos, one car, motherfucker. Alright, I'm pretty happy with our progress today. Chat, I am actually fairly happy with our progress. Um, Yo, it puts a little love heart next to it. Hey, we collect cards. I see. <laughs> well, that's a thing. Alright, quests. We're basically, this is where we're going to pick up next time. I gave the dwarf my money. The fuck? Yo, no, dwarf. Home, homie G. Yo, blacksmith. I gave you my 50 orange, did I not? Like, don't sit here saying I didn't pay you. Thank you so much for the hugs, dragon. Australian version of moose. Oh my god. Shit in my boots. <gasps> Oh, uh, maybe. Need something? What? Because they're always in the middle of the road, and they prefer they're like me. Forest dwelling? Nah, bruh, your your roads going through my forest. Which, to be fair, mostly they are. The lightning rod. It's ready. Fifty orans. Nice. Fifty orans. Like we agreed. Got the lightning rod. Now I got to go to the swamp people to create a lightning storm and do that part of the quest. So we're moving on. We're doing good things. We're doing wonderful things for the environment. <laughs> um, mm, 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 mm. Alright, let me figure out. Can't kill Rams mate to a higher level. We're eventually going to get to this game. Uh, monoliths. Oh, okay, yep, yep. Um, I don't actually have all the Sephiroth that I need for the monoliths. Uh, I think I need like two more. All ten Sephiroth to open the tower. Yeah, I now have seven Sephiroth and just need three more. Um, and I think the Sephiroth is actually these things? Yeah, Sephiroth. So, look, I actually need... Yo, it tells me what they are. Okay, so we've got the Gevrath, Shamar, Tipperath, Oth, and Vena. So it doesn't tell me where those are on the actual map, which is super convenient, but we move. Um, see, it won't give me the map of... It won't give me the map of anywhere else unless I'm actually there, so we shall continue that next time yo alan is also done with his homework let's go we love that for you homework i say homework you, you've been studying like an absolute pog champ so homework is an understatement come back here with me you sweet little things that is definitely enough witcher for me for this evening. I have no desire whatsoever to continue that after stream. I'm glad that we're actually making progress now and the game is frustrating me a lot less. Um, I appreciate Chaplin as well for giving me um, the heads up that it's like a 40 to 60 hour count. It, it kind of, it, it gave me a little bit more space to be like, okay, I don't need to rush the game. It wasn't made to be rushed. So thank you for the head patties, V. Yes, Alan, grats. Beast, do not be sorry. Hang on, let me uh, turn my music back on so we can chat for a little while. Don't even be sorry. Don't even apologize. Um, I'm actually going to probably be taking a break next week before the subathon starts. So um, I'm pretty sure that Tuesday, Wednesday next week, I won't actually be streaming. I'm kind of feeling a little sickies right now. Um energy is sapped and my throat's really sore um so i am going to do my best to get through recording my audio for you guys tomorrow as far as friday's stream goes at this point it is planned but let's hope my body allows me to do so if not um then don't even 
don't even worry about being late because I won't I might not even be here <laughs> thank you so much dragon I appreciate you thank you for the affection Mwah. take care Polly thank you for joining me this evening you guys if you haven't already voted on the um glomp poll please make sure you do it is open to all my subscribers and my patrons um i do have to pin that up on my youtube though thank you so much babes i hope so too thank you viv mm, thank you for the huggies guys i promise i'll take care of myself morning shifts on friday okay best of luck with your shifts viv hopefully it's not um too tiresome for you if you do get tired, I've got a lovely comfy bed behind me. You can't see it because all my tails are blocking the way. <laughs> see pancake? Yes, it's very important to work at my own pace. So I'm kind of tailoring my work to my energy right now, which um, which I kind of like. That game that we went through earlier in stream, AFK Journey, that is definitely something I'm going to jump into during the subathon. For now, I'm happy that we're at a place in The Witcher where I don't feel like a failure. Oh, Nex, you're so welcome. You were on my mind today, so I'm really, really happy that you joined me today. You have no idea. Mm, big hugs for you. Thank you, KP. I appreciate you. Thank you for the hugs, everyone. Thank you. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for your company. All right, then. So wherever you are in the world, I hope you have a wonderful day slash night. Whether you are studying or working or whatever you are doing, I hope the next few days treats you good. Here's hoping I will see you on Friday, 10 p.m. JST. But until then, you can catch me in the server or my socials are all on my website, nathanox.com. <laughs> you cheeky buggers. All right, I'll see you next time, okay? Enjoy yourselves, behave and take care. Mwah.